Ikai my heart, Ikai my heart, Ikai my heart.
sorry, right? As I <laughs> as I was about to start the stream, Subu Subu's like, I'm done eating. Pick me up now. Hello. Hello. Happy Thursday. Hello, hello. I am here now. Hi, hi, Lisa, hi, Cyrus, hi, Kyle, hi, Ryko, hi, Ragnar, hello, Cyrus, hello, Beatrice, hello, Omega, Bisky, hello. Did they say hi, Lisa? I think that was the first, but yeah, 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 don't, don't get a twisted brain. Hello, Ryko, I said that, didn't I? Hi, Farm Boy, hi, Min, hi, Toho, hello, Kati. Swift, hello, also, it's your birthday, isn't it? <laughs> hi, Kuruma, hi, Naimaras, hi, Vicky. Hello, G.I.D. Hello, Yukimo. Yumiko. Dyslexic. Hello, Yazo. Hello, Dara. Welcome. Jonathan, welcome. Portal Pop. Nice to see you again. It's always Subi. Uh, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I'll just say hi to you guys multiple times. It's okay. Um... But welcome, everyone. You're welcome to another Xenoblade stream. Let's fucking go. Oh, shit. I forgot to tell Twitter I was stream. Um, today... Also... What? Oh, my God. Thank you for the 30-month resub. Welcome back to the Fairy Garden. Hello. And competitive stream watcher. Thank you for the follow. Let's go! Yeah! Man, I don't even know what's going on anymore in the game. I think I do. I probably do. Hi, Brood! Hello, hello! Yeah, stuff happened. We went down into the mines, and then... We were like, oh shit... The save file or something with our quest, and we're like, oh no... And then we stopped. <laughs> okay, so, before we get started... Of course, I do want to sing the happy birthday song. Um... But before I forget, we do have a new... A new... Daily watering system. It's not the lurk thing that I wanted to do. I, I... I don't know what the fuck happened. I guess... I was like, one. <laughs> I do one thing. <laughs> and I implemented a singular new thing. So that's cool. Um, did I turn it off? No, I didn't. Okay. Do you guys see the daily watering... Command boot thingy. Holy shit. Okay, it does show up. I don't know how to make it into one singular one message. So the XX my XX bot is gonna be spamming the fuck out of everyone. I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I think I do, actually. I don't know. But the fact that it's one... Um, what is it? The fact that it's one line means that I could probably find out if the people who got watered... So, for example, Alessa, Cory, Frozen Throg, Raiko Sensei, Zyrus, Kyle, Farm Boy, Yazo. You guys got watered, but I didn't turn on the bot yet. <laughs> no, it's through Mix It Up. It's pretty cool. It's um a little bit of a learning curve, but once you kind of understand how it works, it's like, oh, cool. You sent a link? I don't know what this is. Uh, 
I think that's a different currency. I don't know. Um, but I'm just okay. So my idea with that. Here, wait. Let me let me turn on the music from my fucking brain. <laughs> so, the the way that I initially wanted to do this was. Yeah, thank you, Chopper, for stopping by. Good luck with studying. Um, but the way that I wanted to do it was, at first, I just wanted a daily watering command, and then you can see how many times you were watered, right? Um, but then when I was watching the tutorial, um, they were saying, so, for example, this person, they said that what they do is someone redeems an omelet, but there's variety of omelets. So one day you might randomly get a cheese omelet or a sausage omelet or a, a spinach omelet or something. So there's variety. And I was like, huh, how can I implement that into mine? Instead of it just being like, you got water, bitch. Awesome. So at first I was thinking I can make it RNG based off percentage. So like you got watered 1%. <laughs> LOL. Or like, you got watered at 800%. You're like, holy shit, bitch, what the fuck? Or like, you got watered 50%. Smile. 100%. Pog. But then, I was like, well... There's also... We do have factions, or quote-unquote factions, that I have seen Giga do. Because she has like three different factions in her channel. And if I do want to start implementing the concept of that there are different biomes, I still want to find a better word for it in the fairy garden. I was like, well, how many are there? So then I started, um, I started using my big brain <laughs> and I went on my Google doc and I just started like brainstorming like world building stuff. And I was like, oh my god. And I think that's why I only have one singular command that's working. <laughs> Out of all the suggestions that you guys gave me. Because then this kind of bled into everything. And I was like, oh fuck. And then I think I forgot the point that I was doing for that. And then I just didn't set it up for the mix it up. So. <laughs> inhabitants. Is there a more elegant word? I want it to sound... Fantasy. A fairy-like, almost. But I think for now, we can just... Have daily watering as like a... Yeah, fuck yeah, haha, cool, and then... Um, once we implement the, the different biome stuff, it came, I add. then it'll change, I think. So this is basically just like a test run. I don't think you have to worry about redeeming it other than you can redeem it to say hi. Does that make sense? Hi, Rico! Hi! I should probably do like a thing to make it announce or something like that so I can see it. Also, Pranapa! Thank you so much for the... <laughs> Ichibai D. Hello! Thank you for the... Ter 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 <laughs> 30 month resub! <laughs> hello, hello. Hi, Teeny Tanuki! Welcome. Welcome, guys. Um... Also, I just woke up from a nap. I... Oh my god, guys. Okay. I'm gonna sing for Swift first before I tangent too hard. Um, Swift, are you, are you here? Domain or abode? Mmm. I feel like domain just sounds cool and it fits the vibe because technically, according to the war... Um, you like 
have there's like a big fucking dome on top of the fairy garden it's like a really cute sparkly like holographic dome and that's what keeps us hidden in the sky what if i redeem my daily watering twice i think you're only allowed one person per stream so i don't know how effective that is because sometimes if we eat a fairy what would they taste like to think not good <laughs> don't do it no thank you for the twitch pro free twitch pod sub welcome back for 26 it's been a while hope you're doing well you're mine welcome thank you for your daily watering oh yeah also i want to do sound that comes with it too but i didn't implement that yet so i'm gonna do it myself swift thank you for your daily watering. hi lex ah Katsu, thank you for the time, Maya. Miralet, thank you for the daily water. It's a very aggressive daily watering, don't you think? Yummy gold, thank you for your daily watering. <laughs> Donald Duck water. <laughs> Boy Toto, thank you for your daily water. <laughs> Pedro, thank you for your daily water. <laughs> Sometimes it looks like you've been warned one time. So I'm like, oh, what did you guys do? Ooh, but you didn't. It's literally not that. Where did I, where did I leave off? Gravel, thank you for your daily watering. Go, blah, 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 blah. Uh, idle notes, thank you for your daily watering. Robot token, thank you for your daily watering. Blah, 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 blah. Max was Tobias, Liam, thank you for your daily watering. Perfect. Now I just feel like it's like getting waterboarded. Like, I just, like, you know, the, the watering, the watering can like this, except it's like, I don't have any water redeem. I don't have any water emotes, but you know the ones where it looks like they're just getting water shoved into their mouth? Kind of like Phoebe. I think Phoebe has one. That's what it feels like. <laughs> Hi, Kaiser! Amogus. Oh my god, look at the Amogus ass. That's you. Thank you. Thank you for the 300 buddies. <laughs> When I talk fast. Sploosh kaboom sound effect from Zelda Wind Waker. If you find on YouTube what that sound what that sound is, like the sound bite, and you send it the link in my Discord in suggestions. I will consider. I have to listen to it first though. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like our compito thing, but with water. Exactly, exactly. Dwellers, fairy folk, or denizen? Oh. They're fairy folk! Here ye, here ye! Also... Krasork, thank you for the 200 bitties. Thank you. Moye, hello. How welcome. Um, I can't waterboard everyone, so... I'm gonna just use it to say hello. I can't waterboard all the time. Um, let's see. I'm gonna test it if it... Okay. Uh, <laughs> How's it sound? We good? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. You ready, Swift? Sh Fucking gravel. <laughs> it was only a hundred? For real? On my... On my thing, it says that you did it twice. Shit, now I'm not a liar for real. Thank you for the hundred bitties. 
Yeah, it says there's two 100 biddies, and I was like, damn, you did that so fast. Well, thank you. <laughs> okay. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Swift Shot. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. stair step Ooh. 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 Hi Subi Okay turn the shit off Happy birthday Sweat thank you for being here on your very special day and too many many more to come I hope you enjoy your birthday today hope it's filled with lots of yummy food And I guess friends I guess they're like pretty cool too I guess whatever the food is more important Speaking of food, today, I am sad. <laughs> I was so sad that I took a nap. <laughs> I fucking... Onyo oh, is right. Onyo. Oh, I fucking went... Okay, I went on a walk with my roomies because, you know, trying to be all cool and shit, like being conscientious, blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Fuck that shit. I... I... We we were walking and then... And then Kyo was like... Yo, we should get... We should get burgers here. And I was like... I'm not really feeling burgers right now. Because I don't know. I didn't really want anything too oily and... Like... Heavy. Because we've been having steak and rice and caramelized onions for like the past two days. Which is blessing, by the way. But like, you know, beef, 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 beef. And then I'm going to get more beef. I'm like, ah. So, there's like, I don't know. There's a lot of different restaurants. There is like a Vietnamese place and some sushi and even like Mediterranean. But like... Every time we went to go inside to check the menu, everything was so expensive. And I was like, huh, I don't know if this is worth it. Like food prices are getting so high nowadays. And I'm like, I don't know if we should spend this much money right now. <laughs> so then we went back. Well, it was between the Borgar and then... And then there is a place that we haven't been to yet. And we're like, maybe we should try the place that we haven't been to. And I always check Yelp. Just to get the general vibe. You know how sometimes there's like Asian restaurants that are rated low, but the food is bussing. It's just, I think a lot of people dock points or dock stars because of maybe like customer service or something. But you know how like, certain asian restaurants that's just their vibe they're like efficiency max 
you know it's like you're not there to for them to put like a fucking napkin on your lap or something you know they're just there to get your order get it on your table and you get the fuck out <laughs> yeah yeah eat and fuck off yeah so i thought maybe that's what that place was maybe but um i don't know i wasn't really getting the vibe you know but i was like you know what uh, let's try something new and our roommates were like yeah let's try something new i should i shouldn't have fucking done it bro we should have just went to get a burger and i just would have been like yeah whatever at least it's busting right it was so sad it was so like ah uh, you know when restaurants start charging you for extra sauce i'm like bitch <laughs> you're doing what <laughs> now no <laughs> what do you mean i'm the sauce gal <laughs> I want the sauce. So it just made me feel like a really old person. I was like, I'm tired of trying new things. I'm just going to stick to the things that I know. Fuck trying new stuff. Because then when you end up spending like... What? Because things are like... 15 to $20 for an entree or something. But then there's also tip. And then your roommates, like, probably also... Because there's roommates, you probably get, like, an appetizer, too. So it's, like, ends up spending, like, 30 per person or whatever. You're like, damn, bitch. 30 per person for a sad time? I was just so angry. And we're walking back, and I'm like... <laughs> I'm just so mad. <laughs> I'm like a fucking goblin. I'm so <laughs> upset. <laughs> so then I was like, whatever. Fuck it. Fuck. Whatever. I just got Subi and I went and I put him in my bed and I just took a nap. <laughs> my emotional support animal. <laughs> and then I had an alarm. I was only going to nap for 30 minutes. But I had that thing again where I had a busting ass dream or like, I don't know if it was awesome, but it was a dream where I was like, I need to know what happens. So I turned off the alarm. I was like, fuck that. I need to go back in here. And that's why I'm late today. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> but now I feel a little bit better seeing you guys. Having a good day. Gonna play Xenoblade. Did you find out what happens at least? What happens? Oh, in the dream? Well, what was the dream about? <sighs> Maguman happy. I, I don't know if I can remember. My dreams are so fleeting. Also, hi, Phil. God, man, I feel like that's so disappointing. That's literally what I went back to sleep for and I don't even remember what it was. I think it felt kind of post-apocalyptic vibe. Having to save someone something. Something, something, something. I have like a reoccurring... It's almost like a vibe. I don't think I've ever said this before out loud. Sometimes when I... When I'm high. <laughs> and I sleep. I'm not even sleeping. Sometimes it's just like a feeling in my in my brain. It's so weird. I feel like there is an alternate reality tied to me. Isn't that weird? I removed all non-art related posts. The Twitter bullies. What? Who the fuck is bullying you? What do you mean? How are you getting bullies? Non-art related post? What the fuck happened? Who do we have to talk to? What happened? Also enjoy your little crash. Good luck with work. Hi, Ray. Um... 
I guess while we wait for a pose. Um, I, I always have this reoccurring feeling that I have... Hi, Saren! Yeah, I'll send it to you guys. It's a really great playlist. Um, it's like... Almost this feeling that I have to... This is so... I don't know if it's morbid, but... It's almost like... On the other side, and this alternate dimension is like... My other life, or like... Everyone else's life after they Happy die. Nine months, Maya. Just started my study Hi. break, so hopefully I can catch more of your streams, Ikai, my heart. Yeah, good luck with studying once you're done with your break. I don't know how long your break is, though. But happy nine months! Now you have... You are child. You are born. Congratulations. You don't have child. You are the child. <laughs> We're changing it up, everyone. Yeah, poor Tao Top. Thank you for being here. I hope you enjoy your, uh, your break. Um, but yeah, I just have this feeling. So it, it's the same starting scene. I'm against almost like a, a, like a, uh, like one of those blockage wall, concrete wall things that they put on the streets and shit. And I'm up against it and I have a fucking gun in my hand. It's like post-apocalyptic, like already in a war type vibe or already fighting something. I feel like it's robots. That's the vibe that I'm getting. <laughs> It's like robots are some type of like technological war almost. And I'm with I'm with someone that I know. And then I'm with like a, an older lady, maybe in like her like 60s through 80s maybe, but she's like super fit and like, you know, gray hair, gray hair, like salt and pepper hair, whatever. And she's like the commander or, you know, at least commander of our group specifically and i guess when i feel like i die or I get reborn right instead of just dying i'm like Bleh. <laughs> i get reborn into that spot it's almost like you have to die in this dimension in order to get to the real part which is the shit that's going on there so this is almost like the chill vibes like the the in between before shit goes down and you actually have to fight for your life or fight for whatever it's for and and so my friend that's with me they're like are you awake now and i'm like yeah and they're like we have to go and i'm like we have to we have to do this now i'm like oh my god okay <laughs> me who's never held anything <laughs> okay <laughs> yeah it's like literally like you're awake now and i'm like yeah and I guess the world is like filled with people who it's it feels like you're waiting for everyone else to wake up. But of course, we as people on this side of the dimension or this side of this universe, we don't want to die or like, you know, it's not something that we are like, yeah, we have to. It's more like well we do and we do or like i don't want to die and like you know all these different feelings but um it's like you have to trust it's almost like trust the process type vibe or like trust when it happens you'll be okay because at first you know it, whenever it comes to like a near-death situation right it's like i don't want to die you get really scared and Part of me is like, you don't want to die because you're scared of the next life that is like crazy shit, like war shit, like post-apocalyptic, have to fight and, and stuff like that. And I think that's why I'm scared. Not because of like, oh no, I'm going to die and then I don't know what happens next. It's more like I know what happens next and I'm scared of that. <laughs> and I'm like, this is too much for me. <laughs> I'm too high for this shit. <laughs> It's crazy that it happens a little too often. I'm like, what's going on here? But yeah, is it dream or is that the truth? Hmm, smoke joint. I have no idea. <sighs> Chosen by the Monado <laughs> woke you up. 
don't get high on my deathbed got it you know i always thought about that if i'm on my deathbed i don't want to suffer you know i want to have a, a nice like <laughs> a pretty good one you know <laughs> a little nice you know like shit bro all right and then i die <laughs> i always thought about this When it's my time, I want to feel awesome. I don't want to feel unpog. I don't want to feel sad. <laughs> yeah, I did get lost in the sauce. I know, like some destiny shit. Big pro tag energy. Oh my god, thank you! I'm going to be the savior of the next universe. I swear you. Pew pew pew! <laughs> uh, something another artist was talking about how if they followed for art, then un then they unfollow if it posts about food or gotcha pulls wall of. I don't think I understand what you're saying. Another artist was saying how. Oh, like... So you're saying... What, like, another artist was saying how they unfollow artists who mostly... post about non-art-related stuff? And an artist was the one that said that? But they didn't say it directly to you, did they? Who gives a shit? <laughs> fuck them. What? You can post whatever the fuck you want. It's your own account. Coins of me. Thank you for your daily watering. If they unfollow you because of what you post, then they... They don't really care. They can deal with their own shit. Then they're gonna have a TL that's... They're gonna be that person who follows, tries to make sure that they follow under this amount of people because they don't want it to make it, they don't want to look friendly or some shit like that. Literally, there are people like that. I kid you not. They want to look exclusive. So like when you are followed by this person, it's like, oh shit, this is some, like, this is the the cream of the crop right here. Like, I'm exclusive. Shit like that. Oh my fucking God. And then they, you know, make like they uh, they make social media more than it needs to be and it doesn't need to look or be a certain way if you want to have variety and post art but also post personal things and also post selfies or post cosplays fact, trans girls can double jump what is this what is this well, i hear this all the time what does this mean <laughs> i'm sure you do I'm sure you are able to. Hi, Yuxi! Thank you for the hundred biddies. I've heard this more than once. It was it in Clover's chat? Is... Is it? Oh, is it a Celeste meme? I had no idea. I don't know. I'm waiting for Yuxi to confirm. Well, like, fuck him, Oppose. I don't think you should delete or change anything on your tweets. Because no matter what, the people who really enjoy your art, the, they don't give a shit. And they can always, like, you know, filter your media to be like only art or something like i don't know if you're posting too much personal shit then you can always just like if you really want to you can tag things that are not art related by having a certain opposed tag like you know oppose oh oh personal oh p p personal oh oh p personal and then you can tweet saying like if you don't want to see you know 
non-art related posts from me, just mute this tag. And then they'll never see it. Well, like, I don't think anyone's gonna do that. You can also turn off retweets from other people too, if you like retweet too much or something. I had no idea. Didn't we talk about this before? I don't remember if we talked about this. I think maybe we did towards the end of the game. I don't remember. Really cool though. I only retweet. I had a phase where I retweeted, like, a lot of art on, you know, like, my older accounts. Because I figured, you know, if I want to show off other artists' works and how great they are, I'm just gonna retweet them all. So that way other people can find other artists to follow. But then I realized I'm... I think I'm spamming. <laughs> so I tried not to do it as much. But that, but again, it's literally whatever you want to do with your own Twitter and, and it's not like it's, I don't know, whether when people start to pay attention to when their follower account, follower numbers go down or up because they do a certain thing, like you're too obsessed with social media and you just need to not look at that. I see it a lot actually with like content creators like vtubers artists and stuff they like oh i lose followers when i when i post original characters but i only get followers when i post fan art and things like that and it's like that shouldn't affect whether you do it or not you know like if you like what you draw post it Who fucking cares? If people really liked your stuff, then they'll keep following you. And if they unfollow you for that, then fuck them. They're probably not the audience that you want anyway. I'm sorry for spamming. No, I don't mind. I feel like Twitter, if anything, they don't even show me all of them because it's so fucked up and like, I don't understand what the hell's going on. <laughs> I don't know how my Twitter works anymore, so I don't even know if I see them, but I don't think you should worry about it. Hide your numbers? Yeah, or just like don't go to your profile. I don't know. Hi, I do! Maya, so much insight. It's coming from someone who was obsessed with numbers before. I think it's still good. I think it's still good to look at them to a certain extent. Like, if that is your career and you want to see your progress, it's good to see the correlation. But when it becomes an obsession and you check it like every day and, you know, to the point where you notice certain like the smallest changes in numbers, like, no, don't, don't. <laughs> You can use, you can use that time to better yourself. Maybe use that time to study art, to study, I don't know what the fuck you post. Like if you sing or like post things, you can like, you know, sing more covers and use that time to listen and learn more songs to cover and things like that. Or learn, like do singing lessons, singing exercises. I don't know, go fucking outside. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Just do something else. That's why I try not to promote like the usage of social media as often. Like, you know, I do have the socials and I do say at the end, like, yeah, follow follow if you want. Um, but it's more for like to know when I'm streaming, which is the same thing as Discord, but it's not not everyone has Discord. 
Yeah, it's like checking your weight. Like, don't check your weight every day because there's so many very, like, varied factors that go into what your weight is at the time. Especially for those who have their periods. Like, the, the fucking period bloating that fucks up your weight so much and people think, like, oh my god, I gained so much weight or, like, what happened? And it's like, well, human body do shit. Every time someone follows me on any social media, my first thought is why? Because I never see what I post as a reason to follow me. I don't know. Sometimes people just like to see varied types of users on Twitter. Even if you're not like a content creator per se. If you have a similar interest to someone, you probably will retweet or talk about like a game or you know, streamers or artists that you really like and if it's similar to them, I don't see why not. Yeah, Pose, you got this. Fuck, <laughs> fuck what they say. And if they directly say it to you, fucking block their ass. You don't, you don't have any haters of Pose. No one hates you. And if they do, they're gonna get through me first. They're gonna ha they're gonna have to talk to me first. Is there a reason Maya does not use Instagram? I have one actually. I made sure to take my handle because I didn't want anyone else to pretend to be me. But I don't use it because there's n I don't see a point to it. It, it doesn't. The audience that comes from Instagram is not the audience that I would want to show up to my stream, if that makes sense. To me, Instagram is mostly for artists and, I don't know, people who post selfies and photography and shit. But, like, you don't really see people post Twitch clips, you know, or, like, content videos. It's not really a thing. Yeah, it's, like, a lot of influencers and people posting, like, I got sponsored by this. Let me show you this thing and this. And it doesn't really, yeah, it doesn't really translate well because what am I going to post? I'm probably going to post my face, which is my VTuber face, which you guys see all the time. <laughs> so I don't think there's going to be that much variety. It's literally going to be like, and then, and then, you know, it's going to look the same. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to close my mouth in another one. I don't... Other than that, I think I'd probably post, like... Photos, maybe, of my macarons. Tongue out my posts. You just want me to put my tongue out, huh, Eddie? Well, I, I paid for this, so I might as well use it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Can I do the small one? I can't. <laughs> How do I make it the small one? <laughs> I did it, but then my eyes looked weird. <laughs> I did it. Let's go. What's everyone doing? We're just chilling. Hi, Zer. Uh, I'm a little eepy, so um, it's taking me a little bit to warm up to um, playing the game. So <laughs> it's okay. We're literally playing it like what two times this week? Oh my god! Also, VTubers on Instagram just post weird face poses. 
Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, I don't really know what else I would do other than just, like, use... What What is that program called where it has, like, a really pretty background and shit? Whatever. Something like that. And it would just be, like... Like, I might as well just do that on Twitter. I would get way more traction on Twitter than Instagram. It just... The, the, the vibes are not the same. We are not the same. Also, Imai, thank you for the hydrate. 30 minutes ago. Should I delete all the daily waterings? I think we're fine. We're probably fine. Hi, Sonzai! Pineapple, hello! 7 TV look emote? No! <laughs> Maya does a disappointed mom look one day. I pretend to not know what a VTuber is on my Insta because I don't want my feed stuff filled with anime Instagram posts. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, Robert Token, how is Maya doing today? I was mad because I ate shitty food knowing that I am gambling whether it's going to be good food or not, but I fucking did it anyway. So I got so mad that I took a nap. <laughs> but I'm better now, probably. Do I play Resident Evil? Um, I don't know. I don't think I've ever played one before. No, no, no. The only one I played was Outlast, if I'm thinking of like scary games. We have the disappointed mom look as a sticker on Discord. Oh, yeah. Shoost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I can only shoes with like... It's a very specific blue color. It's like a... Not cyan, but... Straight up. Like Kyle's color blue. Like that. What the fuck? Stream elements, what are you doing? Oh god, what's happening? Streamlabs is Stream Elements trying to take Streamlabs' job. Stream key on it? My son sings. I do. I have song requests that I have daily. That if you have enough currency, you can redeem them. Soupy, you want to wake up to take your medicine? It's time. Nightbot goes crazy too sometimes. Good thing we don't have the, th the, th the three of them. And then there's also Moobot too. Ah! Pokemon theme song! Okay, okay, okay. Where? Sarge! Well, guess we're singing. I don't know which one we do, because it, fe it feels really lonely when there's no backing vocals, so we have to make sure that there's background vocals. Okay, let's check this one. Holy fuck. Nice. Oh, you're my best friend. I think I remember how to sing this song. I had the full MP3. <laughs> I had the full MP3. 
that I had in my MP3 player, not an iPod, an MP3 player. And I, I didn't, I didn't have like a way to download songs. So what I would do is I would record them next to my speakers of my computer. It's so fucking cringe. I think this was one of them. Actually, no, I think I had an actual MP3 of it. <laughs> but then I, it like stopped at a certain way. So it wasn't even the full song. It was so fucking lame. But a lot of the anime songs that I had, I recorded them. It's so fucking cringe. iPod, what's that? <laughs> Hi, online girl. Hello, Zelda. We're gonna do some song requests. This is by, Ale uh, by Alessa. This is requested by Alessa. This is the Pokemon theme song. Uh, Ichimaya salute for Ash Ketchum and Pikachu. If we have a 7 TV emote for it, that'd be cool. I don't know if we have one. It's so loud. It's so loud for you guys. Jesus. I wanna be the very best that no one ever was. To catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. I will travel across the land, searching far and wide. Each Pokemon to understand the power that's inside. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. I know it's my destiny. Oh, you're my best friend in a world we must defend. I heard so true. Challenge along the way with courage I will face. I will battle every day to claim my life for place. I can't read. Come with me, the time is right. There's no better team. I'm an arm will win the fight. It's always been a dream. Pokemon, it's you and me. They didn't give me the full lyrics, you fucking bitch. Pokemon, I know you're my best friend in a world we must defend. Pokemon, a heart so true. A courage will pull us through. You'll teach me and I'll teach you. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. Gotta catch him all. Gotta catch him all. Yeah. Catch him all. And this is where my MP3 cut off, by the way. So I hope everything's the same. Pokemon, gotta catch a bitch, you and me. I know it's my destiny. Oh, you're my best friend in a world we must defend. A heart so true, a courage will pull us through. You teach me and I'll teach you. Pokemon, gotta catch a ball, Pokemon. My song cursing because they don't give her the lyrics. It's so fucked up of them. Did you see it? I had the little tiny tongue. Did you see it? I can't do it again. Oh well. Old people rise up. 
Got a favorite Poké season? <sighs> That's a hard one. I think I really like... Hi. I really like the one with... Um... May. But I also really liked Dawn too. It's hard. But the Pokemon Sun and Moon season when the animation style changed and was more fluid is very cool. It, it just felt... It felt good. <clears throat> it felt it felt really nice. So I think Pokemon is it advanced? Is advanced the one with me? I think I like that for nostalgic reasons. And Dawn because I really like Dawn. <laughs> and then I like the Sun and Moon, whichever one that is. I don't. I guess the more recent one. I know Ash's arc is over. I saw the new characters. They still look really cool. I'm just very curious how the community will receive them. But I feel like it'll be filled with love still. The fact that everyone will always complain about, Oh god, another gen again? But like, we would just still be watching. <laughs> we still be playing. So I don't know what the fuck you guys are talking about. So hopefully, hopefully the quality and everything will still hold up and it'll be great. If anything, it'll be better quality. I don't know. We will see. We will see. Um, also... For more song requests, because usually we do multiple. There's a song... I don't know if I know the whole thing, but... The only reason why I want to sing it is because I've been playing a lot of anime music plays. <laughs> And this comes up and I'm like, oh my god, I forgot this was a, like, this was, this was part of, th this is a song. I can't, I can't believe I forgot. So, let's see if I know it first. And then we'll wing it. We're just gonna wing it. Okay? Fuck it, bro. I hope there's backing vocals. Hi, Coral! Choose your partner. I don't think I know it. You can send it in, um... You can send it in our Discord. We have, like, a... We have a Pokemon channel, actually, so you can just put it in there. Okay. This is Lost My Music from Haruhi Suzumiya. Hoshi zora ni age, watashi dake no hikari o shiete. Anata wa ima doko de dareta iru no de shou. Tanoshi to shiteru koto o motto. Cause I'll go 
Is there a bridge? I'm so fucked. You want food now? No. Uh oh, it's falling! Show me, take it! No! God damn it. There's no bridge. But Ray's here, so now I can't not sing it. <laughs> Fuck. All right. All right.
drink it. That's right. Nice. Party party! Are you cool? Thank you. I didn't. <clears throat> I didn't expect to sing that one. It's really fucking high. <laughs> Thank you for listening to the karaoke portion of the stream. And now I have... Still water. What is it? Stale water. Fuck the water. Hinako no OP? Mm, let me hear it. I can't do it right now. But I don't know if I know it. Let me hear. What the fuck? Do you think I can sing this fast? Pickle pickle! I can't. <laughs> it's really cute though. Here's the link if anyone wants it. Maya so can do it. I don't think I can sing anything fast. I don't think I know anything. Muzukashi! Is it time, Moody? You can spit bars. Yeah, you know, and I'm freaking out. Come on, little man. You must drink. Good job. Good job. Daisuke no kinoko hoi. Unfortunately, my friends and I have been playing a lot of anime and music quiz. <laughs> um. It's like ungodly amounts of anime music quiz. I don't... I don't know if I can play it on stream. If I do, it would be the most, like, silent VOD watching stream with me screaming. So, I don't think it would work that well. Maybe on Discord, that'd be kind of fun. I don't know how many people can max be in a room, though. Has anyone ever played it before? No, Yazo! I hope it gets better. Internet problems are so lame. Also, saving points for a real oldie. What's an old song? I mean, like, anime old or... normie old. Yeah, Discord would be really fun. Just be, like, super chill. I'm down to do a anime music quiz night. You guys have some fucking crazy, like... I feel like when there's a lot of people with many different tastes, the anime music quiz just gets significantly harder. <laughs> I think the ones that my friends always have problems with is fucking Utapri. <laughs> Which Utapri is it? And then is it Utapri or is it Idolish 7? Or is it On Stars? Or is it A3? Or like fucking literally any of any male or and then sometimes it's not males at all and it's just inserts from an anime from like a fucking sports anime so fucked up it's an oldie from a movie 
Oh, if it's something I don't know, I, I can't sing it. I do have a song list. I have a song request list. So you have to pick from there. If that's the points you're talking about. Yeah, and then there's also, you know, Love Live. Is it Love Live or Love Live Sunshine? Or is it the movie? And then it's, is it neither? And it's fucking Idol Master. <laughs> and then which Idol Master? Because apparently there's a lot too. And then the worst one of all is fucking Haikyuu, an anime music quiz. Because we have to figure out which one... They, they actually care about which season it's from. Which is so sick and twisted. I don't know which one it's from. I just know I like them all. So we have to, like, remember cues. I think Ham always says it if it's saying, Oh, yeah! And it's the first season. <laughs> it's so fucked up. I don't know, though. I don't know any of the time, like... They have, like, the cues. Another hard one is, um... If they're singing like opera or like some classical shit, is it is it Yuri on Ice or is it um, Your Lie in April? Is it fucking Black Butler when they beat the shit out of each other? Is it Lacordo? So sick and twisted. Hi, Ozuru. Your Lie in April's easy. Clearly, you haven't heard the inserts because then there's also the fucking what is it the piano no more or something the one where it's like the piano in the forest or some shit and then those ones sound similar and I'm like what the fuck because there's inserts the inserts of them playing piano and I'm like which one Do you play with inserts, Kyle? We play with inserts. It's so fucked up. But we do it just so we can get Toradora's Holy Night. <laughs> I mean, that's why I do it. Drink up, Subi. You're almost done. You got this, soldier. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you did it. Yeah, and then there's also ranked. <laughs> I don't think I could ever do that one. How does it pick a list of anime? It goes off of your... Either my anime list or my Annie list or whatever the fuck. There's multiple different ones. So you, you sync your account. Or you give them the username of your account and they use it based off of that. You can also turn on and off the ones that are on hold or that you dropped. I never turn those on because if I drop them, I clearly don't want them to see it. <laughs> um, but yeah, it syncs based off of the ones that you completed, usually. What's it called again? My anime... Wait, sorry. Muse... What? Anime music quiz. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My brain. Hi, Hecate. Welcome. If we connect mine, it will be hell for everyone. See, but then it's a point of, will you catch it? Because <laughs> there's... There's obviously a lot that... So my exclusive one is Gintama. I feel like no one in my friend group watched Gintama except for me. But I don't know all of the Gintama endings and openings and inserts we literally base them off of does this sound old and does no one know what this is okay it's gintama but then there's gintama gintama with an apostrophe gintama with the fucking degree sign on it and then there's gintama different gintama movies and shit like that i'm like what the fuck i always get it wrong i don't think i've gotten a single gintama one right part of me wants to take it off of my anime list but i must be strong i have to just learn them it's so fucked up. I think the only one I get right is the one from Honeyworks. And then the opening, the one that's like... 
Mr. Raindrop falling away from me now. And that's it. Oh, I could probably recognize the first one. The first anime opening for Kintama. But it has never come up! Yeah, Pride Kakume. It's... it's hell. I highly recommend just like playing anime music quiz by yourself too. Like just out of curiosity, because you can play on your own. You don't have to play with friends. But yeah, I feel like Alessa specifically, like if you have an insane library of anime that you like, but you, you know, like you dabble quite often in the anime openings and endings, I feel like you would do really well. Have I ever sang Gurenge? I have. It's really hard, but I have. There's this one anime insert from Demon Slayer, and it's like, wait. And then we're all like, oh my god, I think it's from fucking uh, your line, April. It must be. It's so sad. To oh, we're like, oh my god, it must be from Clanad. We always put Clanad after story. And then it's fucking Demon Slayer. We're like, what the fuck? <laughs> but I got it right once. Because I just like recently watched a movie. So I kind of felt the vibe of like, like, what is it? Like Demon Slayer OST vibes. So I was like, oh, it must be it. And I nailed it. And I we've gotten it like three other times and I fail every time. It's so fucked up. That was awesome. No, no, no. <laughs> Do not underestimate <laughs> reverb. <laughs> Thank you, though. Fucking Kyle! Yeah, you'd be fine. I think a really big part of anime music quiz for my friends is... Because not all of us watch Clanad. But then we always get mixed up with the after story and regular Clanad opening because they sound quite similar. Because they don't... In anime music quiz, they don't start from the same time every time. So if it started with like... Kimi da kyo, Kimi da kyo. I would be like, yeah, after story. But if it like started somewhere like in the verse, I'd be like, what the fuck is this? I don't know which one it is. We get it wrong so often. It's really fucked up. Mnemonic device. What does that mean? Wow, guys. We haven't played in so long that I'm still here. Oh, yeah! Speaking of um, my Nintendo Switch... On Saturday, we're doing Splatoon, by the way. So if you guys want to... Um... Damn, XX Maya XX, I didn't know you would say that. <laughs> um... What, what, what the fuck was I gonna say? Um, if you have Splatoon and you want to play with me, we actually are able to play with each other now, so... Uh, if you don't have Splatoon and you want to play with me... <laughs> you can play! Um, I will say though, you can only play with me, I'm pretty sure, because... If we are on the same team, and I'm on Team Bigfoot, so... Uh, cause it's Splatfest. I totally forgot about that. Um, oh sorry. I know that it was Splatfest, but I forgot that I have to tell you guys to be on Team Bigfoot in order to play with me. So it's kind of fucked up. <laughs> I feel like I should have picked another time. I should have picked another time to do the Splatfest, but I... I didn't. No! You guys are on different teams! What do we do? Uh, 
Oh, that's what it means, Pug. That's crazy. I haven't picked a team. I've been so busy. I had to pick it because I wanted to grind points. Oh, hi, Renee. Unpronounceable, hello. Shit, should we change it then? How about... I will just play with whoever's on Team Bigfoot. And then... I, I'm assuming we'll probably do some Salmon Run. I'm assuming we can also play Salmon Run together. And then we can do that. And then another week we can always just do a regular not Splatfest uh, viewer games. Because I didn't consider that I needed to tell you guys what team I was on. I was just going to show up. I feel like this one is very um, sided. To be honest, like, the meme people will pick Bigfoot because... Bigfoot. <laughs> and then people will pick Nessie because of Shiver, because everyone fucking loves Shiver. And then Alien is like, you know, Alien. Aliens are cool. I feel like it's probably the cooler one out of the three, I would say. Yeah, Bogo's vintage. Yeah, they're cool. And they have the meme. Shit, bro. Fuck. Ah, I should have told Say we should have been on Team Alien for Bogo's Vintage. Fuck. Well, too late now. I'm so sad now. Fuck, I have to go tell Say. <laughs> I'm so sad! I didn't even think about Boko's Binted! Yeah, I guess I haven't gotten my photos printed in a while. <laughs> You're so fucking right. Okay. I don't think I have anything else to talk about other than we're doing a lot of Xenoblade this week on the schedule and then Saturday... Um... Fuck, I didn't sync my stupid... <laughs> um... Saturday is Splatoon and then Sunday we're doing a collab with... The typical Frayed, Prowler, and Clover. We're going to be playing some... Um, Valheim. Since we're done with the forest, we're going to do some Valheim now. I'm very excited. Um, we might have to delay the stream a little bit, depending on when Frey gets home. And needs time to rest and stuff. So it might be 3 p.m., might not be. But I'll let you guys know, of course. Yeah, Valheim. We haven't um, played Valheim on stream before. I played it off stream. Have you guys played Valheim? Yeah, comfy Viking vibes. I don't really know how to. <laughs> I feel like I, I put myself in a situation where I have to put out content when I'm playing, you know, survival games. If that makes sense on stream. Because I'm like, fuck, I can't just like... What the fuck?! <gasps> no! They just disappeared! <laughs> I can't get in there! You bitch. Do I have to change the fucking time? I'm gonna go back in time, bitch. You're gonna be right here. That's fucking right. Oh, hi. Got stuck hunting for single boss to continue. It's pretty hard, isn't it? I don't think I've... Were you doing it by yourself? You watch people play it? Yeah. Oh, you played solo, Renee? Holy shit. Damn, 
Damn, Ryan's telling Emmy, do this shit yourself. The fuck? Daft, thank you for gifting us up to Danielle Gameplay. Thank you so much. Hello, hello, Daft. Ooh, we get outfit. Oh, so I've been playing um, a lot of 3DS stuff recently. And I... I finally opened up the... the um... I'm trying to fucking trade with you. I keep pressing the wrong button. I think these are the same. Um... I finally opened up Kid Icarus. It is not what I thought it was. <laughs> I thought Kid Icarus's gameplay style was kind of like Kirby. Is it not? Did I just... Is there another one that I have to go get? I'm like... Like... Yeah, and then I got the OG one and it looks old as balls. And I was like, what am I looking at? <laughs> Is it just that game and then Uprising and that's it? Why did I think there was another one? Dude, everyone's shit sucks. But it's pretty interesting. It's, um... I think I was playing it when I was really EP, so I was like... Good night. <laughs> but it... It's so interesting. Like, the, um... The overlay style is, like, Smash. Did they do that on purpose? Like, which one came first? I don't remember. Did... Did Smash always look like that? Come on. No fucking way. Oh, there's a Game Boy port, but it's like still the same thing. I see. That's so cool. So they... Did they do... Did they make Smash look similar to... Pit for a reason? Or to, um... Kid Icarus? The guy I worked with on Smash made... Upright... Oh! Oh! Oh, there's alt multiplayer and uprising? That's crazy. I've never experienced a gameplay style like that before. It's quite interesting. Yay, we finished. You have another one? What the fuck? Me dinner. Let's go, food. Master Hero Soccer Guy. <laughs> so cool. I didn't know there was a um, multiplayer aspect. I just, yeah, I was so taken aback by how I did not expect it. To look like that at all. I thought it was just gonna look like, you know, like a platformer, basically. Oh my god! Oh. Uh...
sup? Yeah, nice pants. I actually would like pants like that. I feel like they would be... If they were light, they would look really nice. But I feel like his are heavy as shit. POV or Maya? Fuck off! <laughs> I hate that you're right. The fuck? This is sick and twisted. Guys, I don't know what's coming over me, but I really want to go to Disneyland again. <laughs> my... My monthly quota. My monthly quota has not been met for months. <laughs> I, I require more Disneyland. You know, I... When we went to the Disney, the Minecraft Disney... I... Remember we took a picture in the fairy world, right? Like the Pixie Hollow. And then when I went... I didn't go there? And I... Why, why didn't I go there? W am I crazy? Hi, Pyro! Nice to see you! I don't think they have it at Disneyland, so... That means I have to fucking go to Florida... ...to go take a picture with the fairies and cry. Because you know that's what I'm gonna do. Huh? What are these fools doing? Oh my god, guys, we're we're really strong now. It's over. Who else wants some? Okay, let's get going. Hi Zelda! Hi Pyro! Thanks for your daily watering. <laughs> well, I don't know, Shane. That's the thing. I don't know if it's still around. I wanted to go find out. I, I guess I should look it up before I just buy a fucking ticket to go to Disney World. But I mean, that's a pretty good excuse to just go, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I... I remember when that area first came out and they were like... Oh yeah, fucking... Oh my god. That's a big boy. Die! Ow. Jesus Christ. Ew, it was realistic and it curled up just like it does in real life. That's so crazy. Gross. Yeah, my bot is MXX Maya XX. I can't believe no one has it. <laughs> Complete shock. Yeah, maybe it's not there anymore. But why not? I don't get it. I'm so offended. <laughs> like... What did... What did they want? A, a magical experience? Isn't Tinkerbell the, one of their icons? Because she always runs... Uh, flies over everyone and shits during certain events and stuff. So like, why wouldn't they have a pixie hollow? Why would they remove it? They don't think that people want to meet the pick the, the the fairies. I know. Are they not relevant anymore? Because they so are. By the way, if you're wondering what we're doing right now, um, when we are playing. We were at a point in the mines in Colony 6... Something like that. Um... 
uh, where I think all of the timed, all of the timed questuses. Where am I? All of the time questuses were gonna be gone when we went in there. So, I went back to Colony 9 to see if there's anything new, and then we're gonna try these challenges. <laughs> I don't know if I can do them, but I'm gonna try. I don't think there's any time challenges in here. But, I just wanted to warm up with some casual killing of children in the game. <laughs> This is so fucked up. Ah. Uh. Oh, really? It's still around? <gasps> Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there was a Pixie Hollow event because of the video game, the the Pixie Hollow M MMO or thingy, and then fucking Debbie Ryan showed up and took pictures with people while they were playing the game at the event, and it was so cool. And I was like, man, I wish that was me. And yeah, I've never been. It got yeeted during the Fantasyland expansion. Oh, I am getting mixed... I'm getting mixed answers. I've been there twice. And I've never seen it. It just seems appalling to me. Like, I feel like if I looked at the map and I saw that there were fairies, that I, my dumbass would fucking go, you know? Like, I, I'm going. So why didn't I see it? Maybe I just didn't look at the map. <laughs> Damn, there's more. I gotta go. <laughs> I just wanna go back to Disneyland. Okay, I know you guys are saying... Maya, don't move to Florida. No one likes Florida. But like, what if I want to move there anyway? Whoa, do you see this guy? He's just staring. That's ominous as fuck. He'll be eaten by an alligator. But what if I want to go to Disneyland? What if I want to go to Disney World? Like, I get that I can go to Disneyland, but Disney World is so much cooler. Like, I genuinely want to work at Disney World. Even if I've heard so many things about people being like, when you work at Disneyland or Disney World, you just, like, the magic gets taken away from you, but... Like... I don't know... I think it's kind of, like, the exact type of environment that I would like. Like, I would be, like... <laughs> I know I'm always like... Good day. Fuck the keys! Blah, blah. But, like, I, I think I would be happy. <laughs> there. It's a true test of spirit, for sure, to see if I can handle the... Dealing with children, but... I mean, it'd be really cool if I could just, like, I don't know... Have, like, a little stand or something and be like... I draw your caricature! But it's, like, anime characters? Like, wouldn't they want that? <laughs> like, why do people want caricatures nowadays? Like, anime is basically caricature, you know what I'm saying? But, like, not the really weird, outdated... Like, really, uh, kind of scarily realistic caricatures that people draw at amusement parks all the time. Like, wouldn't people nowadays want to look like an anime character? Or like, I can make them look like the typical style of like, Disney's Pixar, you know? Like, with the big ass eyes. Like... Isn't that basically the same thing? Wouldn't people want that way more? Wouldn't their prices skyrocket? Hi, Disney World. Welcome, I'm Maya. I would love to work with you. <laughs> this idea for years i've always wanted to like but like who the fuck would i tell that to like who who would i talk to about that like hey i would like to be hired but i want to do this in particular but like 
They also have a lot of... Like, people go to Disneyland to do oh, yeah. animation programs. So they clearly know how to do styles like that and efficiently. But I guess they wouldn't want to work at the park. But I want to work at the park. Yeah, I'm going to call Walt Disney right now. Mr. Disney, I'm sure you're very busy. <laughs> another one? Oh wait, I'm done. Dude, am I gonna like... Are they in like a, like a, like a scary cult or something? What's going on? Where? I have to sleep. Go apply for Pixar. Man, you sound like my mom. <laughs> Literally, every time you mention that you like drawing to adults, they're like, you should work at Pixar. <laughs> Literally every time. Every fucking time. Of course I want... Like, that would be sick. But I don't know if I would like it. You know what I mean? How Like, how long would it take until I'm like... Man, I want to freelance. <laughs> it would be really cool to say that you work there, though. I always had a dream that I wanted to see my name... At, on the credits of a of a movie like a movie credit scene whatever the fuck you know what I'm trying to say that was always a dream and yet I just how the fuck I don't know where to go first I'm just gonna go here Um, but yeah, and then I, I guess I realized, um, so I guess my train of thought as a kid, or not even as a kid, just like in high school or college and stuff, was, okay, so if you want to work at Pixar, you would probably be an animator, right? And it's like, okay, so what, like, you'd have to go to, like, major in animation or something. So then, I... Th like, when I started looking into, like, what does it really take to be in animation? Because I actually had a lot of friends... A lot of artist friends who... were animators or who, like, worked in animation. What the fuck is this? Um... And they would go to... Oh my god. I don't remember for the life of me what the fuck it was called. It's a, um... It's a university in... In Toronto, I'm pretty sure. Or no, I think it's out... Just outside, but I think it's in Ontario. It's like a, an insanely well-known arts... Art university. I cannot remember what it's called. But a lot of my friends went there, and so I would see what they did and, like, how they worked. Uh... Okay. What are they... I mean, they're letting me pass, so I guess it's fine, right? We're just straight up in their headquarters? Maybe we're too strong. Maya anime VA work when? <laughs> that would be awesome. I really have to learn how to do proper VA if I want to. Like, there's a lot of strat that comes with it, not just, like, learning how to voice act and act in general, but... You also have to learn to... I'm sure they're fine. The other guys let me through, so... How is this any different? Oh, shh. Okay, the other guys don't... aren't... they're fine. Oops. Uh. 
forgot how to play for a second. Attacking. Oh, this guy. The fuck was I talking about? Oh, but, um... Basically, what I was trying to say is when I learned, how, like, what goes into being an animator and, like, what... I didn't mind about the studying part and working to get to that point. It was more of, once I'm there, what am I going to be doing in the studio? And, like, what am I going to be doing there? If I even get the job, right? And it's like, it's a lot of not guarantee that you're gonna stay at that place. So like, you could get hired at Pixar, but it's like per project or per like thing. So you're not guaranteed to stay there forever. And so you'll probably have moments where you're like really busy working for like, I don't know, some TV or movie or whatever. And then you're done. You're like, oh. And then you have to go find another job. And then you try to like work for another place or like some this place and this place. So it's like no guarantee. And then also I didn't, I guess I didn't really like the idea of, I guess, working that type of style, I guess. I, I liked it up until a certain point because at, at one point I was like, well, I think I really wanted to push being like a freelance more than being contracted. So then I was like, well, why do I want to, do I even want to do this? And then I realized, yeah, Sheridan. God, thank you. I haven't thought of that name in fucking years. <laughs> I haven't thought of that in years. Yeah. So basically the equivalent of me doing that is basically a a, an office job, but like... Um... An office job... But I'm drawing. But like, if I'm already struggling as it is right now to... To draw, and I'm freelance... Then I'm... Then I'm like required... Contractually to do these certain things. Like work with these different people and like... Yeah, basically doing that. Do you think we can kill it? I feel like we can. We're really high level now. Is there a way to, like, negate the attacks? I'm assuming it's... This one? I don't know. But then then them shielding, I guess. Follow EG. Hi, no ball! Post house almost subcontracting so you can be released at any time. Yeah, yeah. Like, you can't, like, guarantee that you're gonna keep your job after you're done. Like, are they even gonna want you still? I don't know. I just felt like. I don't wanna. It just looked like a fancier, a little bit more geared towards what I like. Because it's art related, right? But it's still being underneath like a huge corporation that I don't have control over. I don't really have much of a say over. And so... I just would still feel powerless at the end of the day. And... If there's even a sliver of a chance that I can still do well, or just not even do well, just be happy, be like satisfied with my life, being a freelance and just doing what I want and enjoy it at my own pace, then I would rather do that. And so, and I also realize that I don't think I want animation specifically. I don't want to be an animator. I would rather be an illustrator. So at one point, then I started doing like, okay, well, maybe I want to do um, illustrations for, like, children's books, and I can even make my own children's book, because I like the style of children's books, and I think every book, or every child needs a fucking book, I guess. Like, I don't know if you ever have been to a Barnes & Noble or some library or a bookstore, and go into the children's section, and just, like, I don't know, check out the fucking books. They're so nice nowadays. They're so beautiful. But... 
I think the the hardest part is yeah definitely making it on your own and doing well on your own and it's such a struggle but that's why I'm a streamer because my outreach is a lot different like I think that's the more traditional route that I, I would have gone with if social media and you know drawing on twitch and streaming and stuff was not available or wasn't as hype as it is now because when I wanted to do these types of things it's already highly competitive as it is so I would have to have like an insane portfolio and shit like that and just had to really work hard at it to get to the point that they might consider me at you know but what I noticed when I was on twitch I was like there are people whose skills aren't the greatest they're not like fucking professional like I'm working at a studio like Pixar and shit like that or like Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon and stuff but they're happy as fuck or at least they look happy they have like a really like a fairly high uh, like viewer count and you can tell that like their chat is active and they're supporting them and they're like you know they're they're getting commissions because they're streaming but they're also getting like the subs and the donations and stuff and i'm like but then you get to choose what you're drawing and what you're doing and i was like well that looks a lot more fun than the idea that i had fucking making a children's book <laughs> like making these things and hoping that i make it you know because you can always do that too and do children's books but then or like do it doesn't even have to be a children's book just like an illustration book or an art book and then you just appeal to your own audience and so that's why i chose to not go to school or it was like in half and half because i was accepted to a college in um in canada for art school and i was gonna go but finance problems were a thing so i couldn't but I I realized maybe it's like a blessing in disguise that I should just try something else. I feel like the issue with children's book or art book in general is making profit out of it. Yeah, and that's why I like tabling at conventions or not for the children's book, just the art book. Like I can still make money off of doing illustrations but in my own style if that makes sense so i've always wanted to make an art book i always think the idea is so wonderful to have like because prints are lovely they're nice but they're very i don't know if you guys have a set place to put your prints but for me i have like a big portfolio folder where i put everyone's like 7 11 by 17 illustrations or like an a4 size and then i just store them away somewhere you know like they don't really do anything but with an art book it can be like a coffee table piece like a nice little centerpiece it can look nice on bookshelves like but you don't always have to stare at it but you know exactly where it is there's like you know i guess use for it i guess um but i'm not really much of a an like a an illustrator if that makes sense i think if i made an art book it would be quite simplistic almost like a sketchbook if anything like a flip book um because art books are really really hard to make hi bc so what i like to do instead i like doing knickknacks i like doing charms and stickers um i really like doing charms i like enamel pins i like the cute little i like the cute little things because they appeal to me so I feel like I can make better stuff of that. Like when I make prints, they're not as quality to me. And I feel like people don't really want those in comparison to wanting like an enamel pin or a charm. And also another reason why I didn't want to go to the path of like aiming for, you know, going to univers like an art university, an art college, trying to get into like Pixar or like these big companies and like working that life is also because I feel like if I did an office art job type career I would eventually really hate drawing like really hate it and I don't want that to happen to me I feel like you really have to be 
had a good mental, to be honest. And just like a be very disciplined and know how know your limits and know your self-worth to know when to do and not do certain things you know it's really hard so i guess i was worried to invest you know like 50k each year into an art school praying that it'll be the life that i want you know that's a lot of fucking money you know, like, bachelor's programs are usually four years, and you're gonna do that 50k times four? Plus, like, art supplies and shit? Are you kidding me? Yeah, and the debt will hit, and then there's no guarantee that you're gonna get into, like... The company that you want, like the for like the company of your dreams, you know, or like even if it's not of your dreams, even just getting one, there's no guarantee. It's I don't know, it's just really scary and stressful, and I feel guilt a lot, and it affects me a lot. So I think always having things like student loans and stuff just really stresses me out. And I think that stress would affect how I worked towards my goal of like obtaining that bachelor's. Or, yeah. Hi, Kanazawa. And I think at one point I realized that what I wanted to do is if I really, really tried hard enough, I could easily. Uh, how do I work? How do I say this? At the end of the day, it's really up to how pog your portfolio is and how experienced you are. And you could easily do that all on your own without having to go to an art school. Of course, there's going to be a lot of people who reject you because you don't have that bachelor's degree or like whatever degree that they need or whatever. But there are plenty of people who have the degree and aren't in the skill or expertise that they want. Bitch. Hey, he's pretty low. Whoa, 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 not me, buddy. Okay, I hit him. Woohoo! Dude, how did we level up that much? Before, this guy was so scary. Hey, we're kind of cool! Whoa, we can go on the other side now. <clears throat> Hi, Salad! Hi, Voxel! Machine learning and AI program probably better... Uh, on top of a bachelor's? I don't know what we're talking about. <laughs> you're saying that you have to learn how to use AI nowadays? Is that what you're saying? I'm in a Maya-friendly time zone, but I'm also near my PC again and addicted to Overwatch too. It's okay. It's just a phase. You'll get out of it eventually. <laughs> There's so much to explore. I feel like we should just do the other quests and then... Man, out of all the things you're getting addicted to, it's fucking... Oh god, what did I just do? Okay, so this one is a little particular because it has to be in a thunderstorm. But I'm gonna go to these in, in the meantime. No. <laughs> uh, leagues the same thing. We'll stop eventually, right? Yeah. Um, AI stuff. I know we've talked about it a lot. Um, I think right now, 
it's just really scary because it's so new so a lot of people are exploiting and basically seeing the limits of what it can truly do i don't think it is a terrible thing but people are using it for terrible reasons and are not being very considerate of you know artists and people that they are just basically stealing from i think over time eventually there will be a way to How's it going? control these things so it wouldn't be problematic How's it going? but there's like you know it, it'll take time with any new thing there will be it, it'll take time and i think right now How's it going? it's just very alarming for a lot of people and because we're so surrounded by a lot of artists nowadays at least on my TL. Me. I see it very often and I I just want to stay away from any like art related AI or anything from my field right now because it's not regulated and it's not How's it going? It's not cool. So basically I'm just ignoring everything until things get better. But I'm not putting anything into the fire. I'm not like tweeting about it. I pretty much anytime I ever say anything is in here. Because you guys are smart. It'll just take a really long time until things start. Until the good starts happening because there's going to be a lot of bad. <laughs> We play Genshin, ain't that smart? As long as you don't open your wallet to Genshin, you're smart. So, I was not smart for a hot minute. <laughs> yeah, I would never be a whale. I, I would never do that. Also, I will say though, if you really like a game a lot, I don't see any harm in spending money in a game if you spent if like that's what you spend most of your time on you know and you genuinely enjoy the product and the company or whatever like i don't see any harm in it and it's your fucking money do whatever the fuck you want How's it going? unless it's blizzard yeah unless it's blizzard then don't give them your money i refuse to play i refuse I refuse to spend money in Overwatch. Me. If I ever play Overwatch, even though it's like really shitty company, you know what? I, I've accepted it. Every fucking company is shitty. <laughs> there are so many fucking shitty companies. But as long as I don't promote it in any way, you know, on stream or like, you know, play Overwatch on stream and I don't spend money on it, I feel like that's pretty fair, you know? <laughs> that looked like the glue trap meme. <laughs> Just realized. <laughs> I was looking at it like, that looks so familiar. <laughs> Damn. Alley -oop. Alley -oop. Oh. <laughs> Glue trap meme. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, hello. Just stuck in a glue trap. Your ailment? It's a fucking glue trap, buddy. You're stuck. What? <gasps> also, I know we were talking about voice acting for a bit, and then I totally forgot what we were talking about. But voice acting is also really hard. It's another thing that I briefly, for like split second, thought that I could do. Because I have a friend who... Um, I guess a few friends now, because of VTubing, but... I have like a pretty fair handful of friends that are in 
I still don't get how this works. I get they match in the certain color. Oh, there you go. What was I trying to say? Voice acting. Voice acting, um... I have a, a friend who basically became like a pretty awesome, well-known pog, huge voice actor who even voices in, you know, games that we might have been talking about recently. <laughs> but... So it's really cool to see that, you know, you can become a voice actor, but... I think you definitely have to be in like an agency or company. I think that's what Azir was saying, but I forgot to touch up on it. But pretty hard to get into voice acting stuff. Um, but I don't know. With like VTubing and stuff, it's almost like kind of similar. Almost like a gateway to have like a, you know, to get into something like that. Because you're kind of... If you really want to, you can treat it like voice acting. And you can, you know, easily train yourself to have... ...the voice acting vibe. I don't know how to explain it. Do you know when, like, some people, when they talk, like, you can tell that... ...they would have that voice acting... ...shit down, you know? That's me with Alira. I'm just, like, waiting for this bitch to fucking get it with voice acting gig with like a game i know it's gonna happen i it's not like oh god i hope she like i know it's gonna happen there's no doubt in my mind how do i get down there wait there's another one bionis's leg oh this is the thunder one what is it gonna thunder Zephy, thank you for your daily watering. Red, thank you for your daily watering. Vash, thank you for your daily watering. Daranya, thank you for the daily watering. Sassy, thank you for your daily watering. Moy, thank you for your daily watering. Holy, thank you for your daily watering. There you go. They're gone. Thank you for the 14 months, Gambit. Welcome back. Boo. We're done with these nut strokes. Boo. They're so lame. It's down there, right? Unless it's on there. Oh, I can walk from there. Okay. Hello. Am I gonna make it? Okay, cool. They're funny because they're lame. No. <laughs> Bogo's binges is funny because it's lame. Dude, is it up there? I don't think I can... We'll see. Oh, what's this? Oh my... Have a good day. Am I funny because I'm lame? Thank you for your daily watering. Yeah, but thank you for your daily water. Eventually, I will have a sound effect for you guys. I just don't have it. So you're just going to have to deal with the homemade one. Hi, Tyler. Wave TKM Maya. Wave TKM Maya. What does TKM, TKM mean? Thank you for the free Twitch Prime sub! Welcome back for one whole year! I'm fine. Welcome back for a year! Hello! Thank you for your daily watering! 
I created a post in the Discord. I just don't have the same pseudo everywhere. Okay. Please record the homemade one sound and make it become the official one. Wait, you're kind of onto something though, not gonna lie. Yo, what if I just make like a sound effect of actual water being poured? Or I just make a spitting sound effect. That could also work. Yeah, thank you for the daily watering. <laughs> I'm just waiting for it to start raining. Maybe if I... Is there a way to speed up time? To go specifically to rain? Not the character rain. Oh, hello. Hello. Something bad will happen. Don't let him go anywhere near a river. Got it. I'll keep a close eye on him and make sure he stays close to the camp. All right, all right, you're so true. Oh, you look. Ali -oop. Ali -oop. I think Ryan just like jumped over his fucking body. Where did they go? Is it because it's like nighttime or some shit? Well, it's daytime. I don't think I finished the quest, did I? Thank you for the hydrate and stretch. Hi, Ilka, welcome. Peanut, welcome. Oh, maybe a sprinkler? Here you go, little man. Good job. I forgot to tell you guys. Pug! Are you here? I got my slippers in the mail. They're so cute. I don't know how to take a picture of them. I guess I have to make sure that my feet aren't in them. I'll take a picture of them eventually. They're so cute. Even Kyo said that they look cute. I think he wants one, but none of them will fit him. <laughs> no feet pics? Not in this economy. That's what I'm saying. Pixelate the feet? That's a good idea. Shit, was there an answer to the, uh, thunder thing? Is it just, like... If it starts raining, maybe it'll thunder type deal? Where'd my water go? Actually, let me go get some more water that's not stale. Right back. Thank you. Subi's so cute. He's just on my desk. Next to the keyboard. Like, yeah, I'm gaming. Oh, thank you, Kyle. Uh, 
私は<笑> Yeah, so have a good night. Yeah, that's a rest. Change the clock in game. It has a chance to change every 12 hours. Oh, okay. All right, that's what we're gonna do then. How do you know when it's thundering? I mean... Will you see it or does rain count as thunder? Does that make sense? <laughs> what am I saying? At least it's not like Genshin where it like shows the fucking time and moves really fucking slow. Hit ZR. Oh, no act, of course. I have it. Where'd it go? Oh, I'll enter lurk mode. Yeah, good luck with your audio stuff. Thanks for supporting, Azeru. Hit ZR to open the quest info window. Oh, I see, I see, Raiko. Thank you. Okay. Oh, wait. I wonder if I can turn in the quest yet. The fuck are they? Whatever. I keep pressing the wrong button. Wait. Oh. I've just been doing six hours. I don't know how to use time clocks. <clears throat> Whatever. Hey, look, they're here. Me. I'm glad it all turned out okay in the end. Book for Pama. Metri Metriona and Eva make it. Thank you. Pama always treasure this book. Pama get Granny poem Arda to read it to me. Everyone here is so kind. Yay, we did it. Kiki, thank you for your daily watering. <laughs> Welcome. Ah, there's another quest in there. I gotta go grab it. Are you winning, Maya? I don't know. We're trying to get it to be a thunderstorm to do this quest. ...while spamming the other quests. Because we might as well do something in the meantime. Ooh, Splatoon 3 is doing a to maintenance. Maybe it's for the Splatfest soon? What time is it? What? Zero.
Another quest? There's so many quests this is. Well... We need a rain chant and chat. Can we make a rain chant? Let there be thunder, let there be rain. R-E-Y-N. <laughs> Rain. Thank you. <laughs> Perfect. We're fucked. Wait. It says target not found, so I guess that's the other quest. Uh, those ones don't have a weather requirement, so I feel like they're always gonna be there, I'm assuming, so I don't have to go right now. If not, I'm gonna be really upset. <laughs> Twelve. Target not found. Ragul Lake at Bionis' Lake. Maybe we should go there. Do I have to clear all of the lake first in order for it to show up on my map? Do you think? I feel like no. Actually, no, no, no. Because there's been plenty of quests where it's in a black area and I can't see it. Okay. Alright, time for RNG, everyone. This is the entire stream. I hope they're easy to kill. If not, we're kind of fucked. Hi, Kyle! I should show up as soon as it's raining? Okay. Good to know. We got it, guys. Is this actually the true Xenoblade experience? Is this what you guys normally do? <gasps> it's raining! It's there! Save! Alright, guys. It's time! The chat worked! Our singular Koizumi rain worked! Oh, wait. Kyle has it. <laughs> Thank you, Stream Elements, for that singular chant. It worked! Oh, oh, oh god. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just gonna jump. Ali. It's happening, it's happening, it's happening! Oh, should I get that? No, 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 don't get distracted, bitch. This is the thing you've been waiting for! There it is! Please don't turn around. Ooh, can we do a side one? Yeah, we can! Are you toppled? No, you're just... Okay.
Oh, Subi, no, 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 don't bite that. That's my phone, baby. You can't do that. Oh! You're fine. We did it! And that takes care of that. <laughs> now we can go to the other one. What's up, little man? What a bunch of jokers! Are there a lot of quests that are like that, where you have to... Seventy-seven? Don't turn around. Oh god, okay. One of the... Weather requirements that come up now and again. Not too many. Okay, okay. I wonder why they're okay with me walking in. Is it because I'm too strong? Hey. I think this is the one that I. Yeah, okay. And then... I need this one. Five glowing wisp fluid from wisps on the bionis leg. I think it's raining, so it's not showing up. I'm just gonna sit here. Does this cool weather effect you'll see in this game that's super gorgeous? <gasps> I'm excited to see it. Whoa, what's that? Oh, that's monkey. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. How would you rate the game so far? Holy shit, look at all the whispers! I like it. I like that I can, I don't know, take my time with it and just enjoy it. I feel like this is what... This is how I would play a game like this. Just chill. Chill wow, and goofy. Ago, wow. Lives. Where is your body? Yeah. Oh, dead. Drew! Nice to see you! Hope you've been doing well. Thank you for the two year, almost two years. Thank you for the twenty-one months. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, you can change time. It's super cool. Have you played this, suppose? Wait, I just passed it. <laughs> I didn't... I didn't know we were gonna... Okay. Let's sort this out nice and quickly. Didn't have fluid. I know! Are you? I think it's funny. I think it's goofy and cute and nice and I like it. to touch it. They just do it for me. I'm just very curious to see, like, more of the plot, I guess, once we start doing it. Fuck. 
Oh no, Regno. I hope you feel better. Of course, one of them is right next to the monkey. Where the fuck? It says it's right here. Oh. Smack it. Hope you feel better. We got our second one. Yeah, hopefully it's just rest. Make sure to take care of yourself and lots of uninterrupted sleep. At least there's so many of them. Let's keep on going like this, guys. What's up, little man? You you done? Everyone sounds so aggressively English. <laughs> Hi, Vilan. Felon? Hmm. The fact that there's an O makes me feel like it's more epic sounding. Um, so. When it got. I guess there wasn't any. What's the most confusing part about racing in Finland? Figuring out which finish line is the end. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Thanks for the hundred biddies, just a foolin. Just foolin. I think that's what it is. Thank you. You're silly. Um, uh, but uh, what was I saying? When it got localized, it wasn't localized in North America, and it was localized in Europe, and that's it. So they're they're aggressively English. Come down here, fool. Shit, it's daytime. And the monk is staring right at me. Get me out of here. Yeah, honestly, the charm to Xenoblade is all of the... the British. Do you know what I mean? Holy shit! This guy is really close! Help! Come on, come over here. Come this way. Come this way. No, 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 no. Over here, guys. Okay. I'm gonna grab this. No, it didn't even have it. How strong is he? He can't be... Okay. Have a good day, sir. Yeah, it's definitely... Um, a question that... Everyone asked. I mean, I asked the same thing. There's nothing wrong with it at all. I don't think it's weird or anything. It's just... It's just funny. <laughs> like... How did this happen? <laughs> Come on, fluid. God damn it. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's nice to hear a new, like, group of voice actors. I agree. How the fuck are we supposed to get these guys? I can't jump on these. Can I attract them from all the way over here? Where the fuck do they go? I think they're too far. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. Fire Emblem get a... A no lock... What? What does that mean? Who's this? You brought her clothes back. I did, I did. I think a lot of this cast did work in Final Fantasy. That's what a lot of people said, so... I trust you guys. I don't know anything about Final Fantasy stuff. There you are. Well, I'll use the ingredients to make a potent anti-insomnia anti remedy. Hey, you guys can use this. Ha 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 ha. I think... Are we done? Oh. We have a singular bionis leg thing. Even though it's not... It's not a... A quest. It's not like a necessary quest that we have to do right now. But I mean, it looks so nice and clean if we just finish it. Where the fuck do we have to go? Oh. Have you looked at the affinity web yet? Oh my god! Hi, Gonzalez. Where, where's the affinity level? What the fuck? Damn! Pitiful! Pitiful! How do we make Sharla and Ryan like each other? I can give them gifts? Wait, no, 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 no. You don't like any of these? Can I just get... Oh, oh wait, no, I think that's a quest item. Can I just give her anything? 
Oh, you have to give it to them once. All right, <laughs> I know how to get the 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 girls to like me. Women want me. Fish fear me. She wants a. Uh. A humming plum. Uh. No! Yeah, I knew it. Broccoli? Oh, I know you, girl. No! Nice. Ooh, <laughs> she like it, the figs. No! <laughs> yeah, you like that kneecap rock. So, are we like friends yet or what? <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> I gave her so many things. She don't like? She doesn't like the rhinestone? How long does it take for me to woo her with items? Oh, this is a nice... Um... One who killed his friend and he's just fucking standing here like, yeah, I did that. <laughs> what a fucking bitch. We'll avenge you, buddy. It takes a while. How often should you do it? Did we do the quest? Apparently. I don't see any flowers. Shit, while we're here, we might as well get that quest. Wait, I think it's faster if I just do this. Gonzalez, nice to see you again. I must go. So I go around, around this. Hitting B button during battle helps raise affinity. Okay. You need an insane amount of affinity points to level up their bond. Okay. I see, I see. Oh yeah, I have to keep doing that encyclopedia collectible thing, right? That sound. I want to use that for the watering sound. <laughs> Water. Here's your daily watering. That would be cool. 
I want something like really simple that's like very like not in invasive. Or maybe something even smaller than that. I'm never gonna get a heart to heart, I swear. Okay, let's go this way. God, this place is so cool. The factory area is time limited, but you're able to trade for the rest of the Collectopedia items if you miss them. Oh... Okay. You come just in time! Get a good ass friend! That doesn't sound good. That's quite a problem. Kato got really worried. He went to look for food for dinner, but he did not come back. Do you have any idea where he could have gone? Kato could tell him to not go far. He always get lost. Kato could think he'd go very far. He has a sense of direction. He's probably completely lost. Gatego already looks so hard, but Gatego cannot find him. Please help Gatego find friend. Yippee! Yippee! <laughs> that was the sweetest, tiniest yippee I've ever heard. Yippee! <laughs> Thank you so much, Colby, for the tier two. Welcome back for thirty months. Thank you very much. Yippee! Shit. He said what now? Howdy, how are you? Is this what we're doing? Yeah. Okay, okay. 26 months woo. Lurk, 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 work, work, work. Ikai, my. Lurk, 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 work, work, work. Sounds about right. Mm. Curve, thank you for the 22 months. 22. Uh, 26 months. Thank you. I'm going to cut corners. I'm going to just fucking jump off. Oh, shh. Here we go. They lost four months. Sorry, Curve. Didn't mean to do that. Welcome back for 26. How are you? Also, Ashton, enjoy your lurk. Wait, so you guys said that the mine... The, are you talking about the one that... This one? This one is limited, so I should get all of the Collectopedia stuff while I'm in there. But it's not the end of the world if I don't do it. I think I'm gonna do it, probably. Knowing my dumbass, I probably want to check out the whole thing. Double yes. Double thank you. Oh my god, look at that thing. Holy fuck, I hope it doesn't touch us. That thing is so fucking scary. I hate that it's out of the water. Actually, I'd rather it be out of the water than... ...in the water. A part of it will become inaccessible. If you continue to go... Continue the story by going to the bottom. All right. Eh? Akira, hello. 
How are you? Welcome to our adventures in the leg. Sup? What do what do is out on adventure? I having a good time finding food. Gerugu looking for me? What do what do make Gerugu worry? When what do what do having good time, he forget about everything else. Fucking me. What do what do always get lost? What do what do always make trouble? I go back soon. You come too. All right, what do what do. Are Batu Batu's Batu Batu the little dudes the equivalent of like f falafels in Final Fantasy? That's the vibe that I'm getting. No point. Yeah. Yeah, the nopong. Look at them! They're dancing in the fireplace! They're so cute! They're like little nerds. I guess falafels don't say their own name. Talking third person. Kero go so happy! Watu watu back! Kero go so happy he asked you to help him! I'm glad everything worked out. <laughs> Right. It was well worth the effort. But the white would never leave Gerugu again. Gerugu, thank you so much. Yeah, I feel like they're both small and evil, you know? No way you have a quest. Secret present? Tokila's egg to make Nopon's secret present. Me, Pandora, Mushroom. Bata Bata wants you to help. What will you give your friends? Make something when you bring egg and mushroom. Then I get the friends. Can you... Get these things? Is this timed? If it's not timed, we're just gonna go back to the... I always press the wrong button. Die from your voice acting for the note one? <laughs> it sounds like it. Okay. None of these are time, so I think we're all good to move on in the story. Hi, Borf! <laughs> Enjoy your daily watering. Oh my gosh! I almost forgot to tell you guys. We got a really cool Google Doc. So we got a Google Doc from... Where are we? From Noba, who... I think they're in chat. Noba Chono. They made a Google Doc called How to Zeno Your Blade. <laughs> um, and this is based on my characteristics uh, at level 25, which is right now. So... I should use it. Ah, but they also made it editable. Edit the edit editable editable. You can edit it. And they said, feel free to share with your chat, and you guys can. There's two docs. Where I 
Michael made one too? Oh shit, there's two of them. Where's that one? Creative channel? Oh! Oh my god, yours has little, like... Cool icon stuff. I see you on the dock. Oh, I will make sure to use these. Okay, let's use it right now. Yeah, I'll use... Let's use... Raikos for... Right now. Because I'm doing this stuff. Thank you to the both of you! It's so awesome! If you guys want to see it... It's, um... Here. And then if you guys want the one from Nova... So you guys can still edit this one, but try not to... Uh, delete anything from Nova. Nova already has a... An alternative, like a backup dock in case this one gets fucked. So it's not too bad. So don't worry about it. I love how you guys put pictures. Thank God. Thank fuck. But if you guys have anything you would want to add to the Xeno Your Blade, you guys can add them somewhere. Maybe in different colors and stuff. I made you this cute guide. Uh, the Fairy Gardens What Do is from Raikou, and then the other one is by Nova. Nova Chono. You guys should put your name on the title of it, so we can see it. Do you think... Do you think... Raiko... You could add... Like a priority... Like this would probably be the most important to level up? Or is that more preference? I think that's my biggest problem is like... I don't know which ones to... To prioritize putting levels into? It looks like I want to finish Metal Blast because it uh, inflicts the break and then you can topple in the days. So that would be nice. Uh, let me see if there's anything else. Sounds like math. It's. It does feel like it. Thank you for your daily warning.
like covert stance is actually kind of cool because then she doesn't gain aggro which is good for a healer and then out of the damage stuff these pink ones is this even pink the purple one I guess according to this when they're asleep, it'll wake up if you get hit by it, but Ryan has a lot of area AoE attacks, so it wouldn't really be that useful with our current party. So I guess it, we can level up this one. And I kind of want to get this one. Wait, are we good on these ones? Well, I can't level them up, so I'll just do this one. I don't know which one to replace. Shield absorbs damage. Temporary debuff immunity. Aww. Okay, let's try it. I think these guys don't have a lot. Oh no, you guys do. Takes less damage, deals less damage, and enemies take damage when they hit them. When is rage useful? When it's like fighting a boss, I guess? Because when an enemy hits him, they also take damage, so... Mm, I feel like we should level this one up a lot and use it. Um, forces an enemy to attack Ryan makes mad taunt. Give more aggro. this Place guard shift? Okay. What was the one that I replaced just now? Berserker? really don't know anything to do with these things or so I lit I probably wouldn't even fuck with this shit if I was playing by myself. 
I, I just would not touch anything. <laughs> I would just keep... Pew pew pew! Pew pew pew! Okay, let's read... Shulks... So this one's a day's one, so... Probably should level that one up. Been using this one a lot. Someone said put more into this one times, so, and I forgot to do that, so... Okay. Wait. I think the Monado has a different one, doesn't it? Nope, it doesn't. Yeah, she looks fine. Okay, so... We're pretty much done with the timed quest that we were working on, so let's just go back into the mine. Quite a lot of stuff that we kind of missed. It's like a huge thing right here. Are all the items that spawn, are they in the same area for every game? Like, is there a Guide Waluigi for the Collectopedia, I guess? Because the only thing we're missing are the two parts. And if I can avoid not walking around everywhere in this big ass fucking place, I will. You just keep refreshing the area until you get them? Like that one? Damn it. What you get from the blue orbs is random. Oh. How do you refresh? Do you set the time? Like... So I guess you just find a place that has multiple orbs and you just... Keep going there. I feel like this one's honestly pretty pog. It's just one, but... Leave the area and come back. Oh, okay. So I think I have to leave in like the... Wait, leave the area as in like leave the map? Like leave the mine or go to a different TP? Need a map? Shit. Do you guys have a recommended grind spot for the collectibles in the mine? <laughs> this is such a very specific thing. I drink water. Hi, Abby. We're just trying to get collectible stuff because I'm a collectible person. Where you meet the old man? Um, do you know where that one is? might be here? I know it was like a square area, but... 
Oh, it is mining days. Okay. Huh? Am I crazy? Oh, there it is. It's like, what the fuck? I can't get out of here. Camera. <gasps> I see a dot. We're screwed. Maybe if we just, like, walk around this pit. Surely these things won't attack us. We're too high level for that. <gasps> Dots! Love Crane? Fire Abron. Ooh, they're gear items, aren't they? I wonder what the odds are of it dropping. What does it mean again when their icon is blue? Does that mean they're friendly? I forgot. Waluigi. They're like little... I think I forgot one of the Reinhardts. That's okay. Slightly high level? Okay. So they respect me. <laughs> How long do you think it would take for me to find it? I feel like this is gonna be really hard. Maybe I should just find it another time. So you said that I could find it... Even though the mine isn't going to be here anymore. So... Is that through trading, I'm assuming? Or... Let's... Gotta get this. You can come back later. I thought someone said that you can't come back later. Oh, only a small part. Hopefully that small part includes some blue shit. Oh, okay. Then let's just go down, shall we? I don't know which one is the good one. I'm assuming it's the bottom one. I think we have to go all the way down the pit, right? And like, go... Like that? Maybe we could go on this one. Wait, am I higher up here? Fuck it, bro. Sup, bitches? You don't even care about me anymore. I'm too epic. They don't fuck with us! Oh, that's right. There's different levels. Fuck. Okay, let me... Let me grab this and then we can go check it out. Wrong button. What? 
B3. Let's do this one. Oh, sorry guys. Uh I'm sure they're fine. Oh I wasn't trying to leave you guys, I swear. There's still quite a bit of orbs that we can interact with right now. We're gonna fight down there. Ryan? To hit peril! I remember this part. And then the thing goes up. You're too hot, Ryan. Don't jump. No. <laughs> we should probably double check if we have any, like, weapons and armor to uh, wear, too. We got quite a bit of stuff when we were completing the quest. This was. You had a Eureka moment? What is... what happened? Rhine time feels Rhine man feels rain man. Look, there's a bunch of stuff. Damn it. <laughs> because it's like rain. Is that why? Is this it? Oh, shit. This is it. Alright, everyone. If you have... ...any outfits to change, now is the time. Strength and agility. Can't Ryan wear heavy armor? You think he would be able to? How am I? I'm chilling. How are you? I think that was it. Oh wait, no, I didn't check if we had better weapons. They're both Lieutenant Pikes, and then I think I have a new one for you. Yeah. Oh, but then we were debating because these ones have the ability slots, and then the other one doesn't. And then, according to the doc, 
ether. I don't have a high ether, but uh, we can just use something. Oh, they're stuck. Maybe we use this one and just... Ryan can learn one of his skills to let him wear heavy. Learn a skill? Where do you learn the skill? In here? I don't want to learn. <laughs> it's probably fine. All right, let's fuck up the shit. Let's 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 wait. Did I save? I think I did, but I forgot already. So I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> okay, for sure we're doing it this time. Wait, run! I'm very fine. Wow, guys, this looks quite ominous down here. A little suspicious, don't you think? No. They're gone. So whose blood is? Oh no. Ah, here at last. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Fuck. Isn't that? It's him, all right. He's the one who took Juju. Where's Juju? Juju and the others. Tell me where they are. <laughs> you want the brat? Well... He's right here! Oh no. He's still alive. But don't think he will be for long. As for the others... Well... <gasps> just couldn't help myself. I ain't of all up! Oh god... No. Welcome to our banquet hall. No. Tonight, the main course will be you. <laughs> and if I've still got room, the brat will make a tasty dessert. <laughs> Murderer. I'm Zord, your host tonight. Zord. So you have a name. That's what they all say. Can't say that I remember it myself. What's he talking about? Oh, yes. It's good to see fresh meat on what? the table. These colony folk just didn't fill me up. <sighs> the music's bussing, but Gather. it's so sad. The others. <laughs> Cattle and company. <laughs> Dinner's ready. I swear I won't stop until. 
Please don't die. His designs are really cool. Uh oh. Using a chain attack, large monsters can resist break arts. However, they generally cannot defend against the break art used during a chain attack. If you encounter, oh no, they want me to use brain. They want me to use brain stuff. If you encounter monsters that can resist break arts, try to inflict break during a chain attack. So they're saying that normally you can't do break, but in a chain, I can inflict break. So I have to pink. Topple is is green. Daze is the olive color. And how do I inflict? How do I start a chain? Does it just randomly happen when we have enough on the gauge? Is that what it is? You fill up the gauge and then there's chain ability. Okay, okay. You haven't learned it yet? No, I did. I'm just trying to make sure. Yeah. Okay. And then... I think I get it. An arts bonus effect will fill up the party gauge. If you can pull burst affinity, will also fill up... What the fuck is burst affinity? <laughs> huh? Press B at the right moment when the burst affinity. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's what it is. All right, guys, let's go. He. He's just laughing. I can't... I can't go behind him. Oh, shit. I'm coming, Ryan. Give me a second, brother. Oh, shit. There's dudes? We should probably kill this, these little ones first, right? Oh, fuck. I was... Uh, uh, whatever. Maybe we could sleep him. Do we have sleep? Nope, we don't. I forgot. Uh. Well, I don't want to do it against this guy. Whatever. I'm 
gonna be a little sneaky. Okay, let's just... I didn't get it. Focus on the food. Fly bit me. Fly baby. Oh. Okay, let me try it. Pink. Pink. Green. Not up. Uh, we don't have it. <laughs> this one. You have it. How do you like them apples, bitch? Summon dudes? Maybe I should just not even focus on the... on the little dudes. again? No. Okay, triggered a cutscene. <laughs> the fucking two. <laughs> we'll never get to Juju at this rate. I've got to think of something. When did he get down there? What the fuck? The future. How did they how did they get them out of the, the triangle? Yes. That's it. Let's right. go character development. You got to do. Shock! What are you doing? Right. 
cold man. Do you think you can stop me? No, I Dude, don't. this guy is badass. I do this. Oh! Let's see if that mechon body of yours can withstand an ether river. Don't mind if be a priest. <laughs> Wake up. Shut up. Leave the rest to us. Hang in there, you old fool! Fall, you damn machine! No! Grab him! Atharon! Hold on! Oh! It has an extendo. I thought I was like, damn bitch, how the fuck are you gonna make it over there? Shulk! What a shot! What a shot! Boy. We can change our destinies. Extendo! Patronum! Not today. Um guys? Um guys? Don't you dare. He's gonna... No, no, no! Now, my friends. But not before. Gado! This is for you. This is for the people of... Wait, is he gonna stay up there? Okay. Slay! Wait. Uh oh. But I. This isn't supposed to happen. Atharon! Gado, I'll see you before long. As soon as I saw an ether river, I knew this had to be the place. He's so smart, my baby. Look at this bitch in his shorts. Juju, you're safe now. What did I tell you? You and me can make anything. I thought happen. that fight was yeah, gonna be really hard. Right. I think I'm over. A boy I thought we had to kill him. I stand corrected, young man. You've done a great deed here today. I was so scared. I didn't really do anything. I couldn't have done it without you guys. Tell me. Your vision saved me. I'm over leveled. What, <laughs> what happened to Gado? Uh. No. I see. Can't save them all, I guess. Charla, take this. Gado would have wanted you to have it. Time to head back to the camp. <laughs> I just we'll love that Choo Choo's on the floor. <laughs> There's a freight elevator on the next level. From there, it's an easy route out of the mine. As long as it's working. We'll know that when we get on it. Oh, that's the one that I tried to walk you up to. Laugh. Well, I'm right, ain't I? Charge <laughs> you with the glue trap? You're absolutely right. We need to move on and stop worrying about every little thing. 
Come on, guys. <laughs> he is laying in those shorts. They're so good. Wow. I thought... So, my strat in that was like, okay, kill the ads first, then go towards the, the dude, right? Like... But then he kept spawning the dudes, and I was like, okay, well, maybe it's just that one time. But then he did it a second time, and I was like, maybe it's because it's a bigger wave, so let me try that one. But then when it happened a third time, I was like, all right, fuck it, bro. And I just went towards the big guy, and I was like, maybe they just want me to just hit him. And that is exactly what they wanted me to do. <laughs> Thank god, I thought we actually had to like fight him, fight him. I love when things get interrupted by plot and then you don't actually have to fight them all the way. <laughs> Hi, Polly! Thanks for coming! As we're there just to charge the party cage and get a chain attack. Yeah. I see. It's basically tutorial boss. Fucked up. Did you see that? Saw through the the rocks. Do I have to walk? I feel like I could just. Yeah, isn't it this one? Well, actually, no. I think, I think this is faster because it'll go counterclockwise. I think. I think. So this will only be one trip rather than almost going a whole round. They give us another tutorial boss. There it is. <gasps> nope. You can gaze into the future, future, future. No! Oh, I'm good. You guys made it, right? Guys? Right? Right? <laughs> right? Hello! <laughs> he looked so disappointed. He was like, you didn't fucking wait for me. Run <laughs> time over. Holy shit, that was so fucking awesome when Ryan caught the old man. Oh! That was so hype. Works perfectly. Look! You see? Juju's standing, kind of. We're all impressed. It's always a rhyme time. So fucking true. Pug, thank you hey, for getting us up to Polly. Uh oh. No fucking shot. I should have closed my fucking mouth. This is our chance, guys. We're gonna have to fight him on this? You're joking. What a bunch of jokers. Oh my god. Charge my fucking Monado shit, bitch. It's always Ryan time, baby. Uh, what do we start with? Oh, fuck. I clicked it on accident. Okay, no worries. We'll just do it again. Shit. Oh, I cut. 
comes back. Okay, whatever. We'll just do this one. Wait, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> you know when you want to say something's free in a game, you just do this. <laughs> Got it! Thank you. The hawk for the Gaddy hundred bits. We gotta go. Gotta take a shot every time they mention the Monado. <laughs> we'll be fucked up. Do you guys think we can still go back in the mine? <laughs> oh. It'll be fine. We smashed that bronze idiot. Now the people of Colony 6 can rest in peace. Yeah. Uh, uh, Are you okay? Shala. I thank the stars you're all right. Where are we? What about me, Just Charla? I, I have a boo-boo. Thanks to Charla Shirk and Ryan, we destroyed that Charla. thing. But not everyone made it. Charla, me too. Oh? I'm so sorry. Shulk? Ryan? I didn't mean to cause any more trouble running off like that. Forget about it, kid. We settled the score. Thanks. Yes. But there's still no sign of that mech on with the metal face. He's the one we're really after. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I could solo it. <sighs> no way! Metal face. No, no! What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Oh my god. Why do they look like Zord? Dude, it looks really cool. Get out of there! Get out! <gasps> That's so <laughs> fucked up of him. Dreams were music to my ears. My claws slid right through her soft flesh. Like a hot knife through butter! <laughs> Uh-oh. Talk all you want. Because those words will be your <gasps> Woo! Yeah, Drinks water. Oh, 
Why he looking so Victorian? Looks like we were just in time. Why he look a vampire? Oh my god, we have homies! Party formation is shown whenever there's change to the traveling party with the menu visible. Select main menu, press A. Rearrange party for battles. So they're telling me to fight with them. Is that what they're saying? I feel like they're telling me I should fight with them. But I feel like Charlotte is so awesome. But Dixon's so cool. Um, do you guys want me to put Dumban and Dixon both into the party? I feel like we have to. It's like fighting with the homies, you know? Sorry, Charlo. Oh my god, you guys have any art you could share with me? You guys have any... You guys have any... Oh, oh my... Ugh. Oh. Guys, I don't want to think about this. <laughs> what the fuck? I have to do this to both of them? Gale Slash? Okay. Just tell me what to level up and I'll do it. Gale Slash, World Slash... Battle Eye. Pink and green. I guess he's our tank now, right? Fearless? Okay. Dodge tank? Interesting. Looks like we don't have to do it with the other guys, so that's cool. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Man, I feel like there's something really awesome and cool and we're like hanging out together. We're like bros and stuff. But like... Ah, there's so much on the screen. I can't even be like, Oh my god, this is so cool, guys. We're like hanging out together. And they're like, dude, shut the fuck up. We have a war to finish. Your days are numbered! How good are we? Look at the other guys. So nice of them to just like wait while we just beat the shit out of the other guys, you know? Yeah, boys are down. Is boys are down. Where are they coming from? I can take the smaller ones, but the rest will be like fighting Zord over and over. If only the Monado would work on these things. Focus, Zord. Look out! <gasps> Ryan. <laughs> Look at you all. Look at this metal brain. That it, Grandpa. No, Many Grandpa. Ideas here. You may be able to block a projectile, but let's see if you can block this! <laughs> what? <laughs> Tell me, how does it feel to be such a pathetic hero? No, don't say that to Dumban! Hey, Dumban! 
You can use Buster once or twice? Okay. How do you see the cooldown? Or like, how long it's lasting? What are you? Save it. I am interested. You little maggots need to learn when you've been stepped on. What the fuck? Everyone, fall back! Now! Won't change a thing. I'm gonna wipe you out once and for all. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. We must be outside the tower. Welcome, true heir Whoa. to the Monado. Father! Buddha! Weak, weak and pathetic. What? Oh. Or who are you? You will pay for what you've done! Dang, he's getting a lot right now. You will know the pain and suffering you caused the Emperor and Fiora! Spoilers! What the hell? Uh, another one. Enough of this. Uh, you got lucky, brat. Next time, your head is mine. You're not getting away! Get back here! Why did they so, choose to leave? Right, I feel like they totally could have still killed us. You've got to be kidding! He's the one who killed Fiora! Know your limits. We'll get another chance. Fine. That thing saved us. Whatever it was. Ah, uh, plot convenience. Yeah, you what's well. this thing? <gasps> but what of the boy? R R R Kingdom Heart. Uh, 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 well, then, hot, there is much to hot, be done. Hot, <laughs> Whatever. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. I thought it was. He's hot. Nice to see you, Dixon. It's been a while, Grandpa. One year, if my memory They're both fucking me. grandpas. Hello. Good to see you haven't kicked the bucket. <laughs> Put a sock in it. Wait. Dixon. Dunban. You're the heroes who risked your lives a year ago in the battle to defend the colonies. What's a pretty young lady like you doing? Oh god, Dixon. Dunban, Dixon. Thanks for helping out back there. I don't believe we did anything. He's right. Save your thanks for that giant bird. What was that thing? A telephia. A mystical beast that protects the sleeping Bionis. Though I've never heard of one ever venturing down to where us Homs live. Strange. Mm. A telephia. So that's what it's called. A mystical beast that protects the Bionis. So, what's your plan from here? Follow that metal-faced machine, I presume. What else? He's gonna pay for what he did to Fiora. Well then, there's only one place to go. Galahad Fortress in Sword Valley. A year ago, those things were building a huge fortress, right in the valley. Tactically, it's an excellent location to launch attacks from. I feel there's a strong chance they've now finished building it. That would explain why both colonies were attacked recently. Sword Valley. The very place where we made our last stand one year ago. Mm. So it's settled. Bash down a fortress and smash some metal brains. Easy rain. Shulk? Shulk? There's somewhere else I need to go first. But what could be more important than... Wait. You saw another one. Saw what? What are you on about? 
Music is so sick. These visions sound pretty handy. Well, out with it. What do you see? I was somewhere very high up. I was fighting at the peak of a huge tower, fighting Metal Face. I heard a voice, and then the Monado's power was unleashed. His armor instantly gave way. The Monado doesn't work on Metal Face at the moment. But if that vision comes true... A tower, huh? Doesn't give us much to go on. Can you remember anything else from your vision? I remember... a huge horn. That's it. As I fought Metal Face, I could see the Bionis head. Prison Island. Prison Island? I've never been. But I've heard of a black tower at the head of the Bionis. They say it was built by the ancient High Entia race. The High Entia are real? I thought they were a myth. I wouldn't blame you, son. An ancient race it's so at the cool the that there's all these different it races that they don't even know crazy. about. But Bionis is home to all kinds of different people, not just us. That includes the High Entia. The High Entia, huh? I dismiss them as folklore as well. Never assume anything. Seeing is believing, right? Have you ever met one? Well, yeah. Wow. Dixon, man, you're just full of surprises. Mm -hmm. What can I say? I'm well traveled. <laughs> and it's all for your future. Aww. Day and night I've searched for new lands, met new cultures, and gained knowledge for our people. The life of a wandering old fool. A lonely one at that. <laughs> Stop your whining. You do it because you enjoy it. And you make a tidy profit. Who asked you, Dumban? Well then, Hulk, <laughs> what's it to be? <laughs> we'll head there. There are alternatives. We could abandon Apple. the colonies. Find a place the Mekon will not discover and live in secret. I realized something when we were fighting Zord. Wherever we go, they'll follow. We can't run from these things. We must fight on. Mm -hmm. I see. Then I am obliged to join. <gasps> Party member! You want to come with us? Scared I'll get hurt. No way. We know you're stronger than anything. Right, Ryan? You bet. I've recovered a great deal since we last met. That's good. And that miserly old coot over there made me cool. miss. Sharp. Light. Perfect for cutting through steel. Show me a mech on and I'll slice it in two. I might not be in peak condition, but I'm useful. I can't thank you enough. We're thank in together you now. for your... You Wait, that's not a... Dumban. Never mind. Miserly old coot. That sword is forged from mech on armor. It's worth every penny. So you keep saying. If you want to go to the Bionis head, You'll need a guide to get to the upper regions. We're at the bottom, so I guess the only way to go is up. Right. But we'll need to go up the lower back first. The lower back? Colony 6 is right at the top of the Three Bionis different bots. Lake, so we'll have to head around the waist. Through a place called Sartol Marsh. Sartol Marsh. Yeah. Is he left-handed? Cause... Was, was he always left-handed? Because his sword's on his right side. Ah! Wow, what a Chad. Learned how to be left-handed. That's fucking insane. Uh, let's stay with Dunban. We'll have a little, a little, a little boys' night. <laughs> I'm assuming we can't go back in there for a while. Hmm, where are we? Lefties gang, lefties gang! Do 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 do. 
I've like given up on those fucking heart to hearts. Like, they're never gonna give them to me. But now that I have done Ben, I feel like they're gonna give them to us. I don't know anymore. I feel less weird for being a lefty. This is why it's so important to have representation in media. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> My grandpa <clears throat> was actually a lefty, but because it w I guess he was born during the time where anything weird is like... Yeah, weird. He was forced to be taught to be right-handed. I'm really glad that that never happened to me. <laughs> Such an interesting time to like force your child to be right handed because they thought you were a fucking witch or some shit. <gasps> it's so pretty! Wow! Boys' night just got so much cooler! end up here so fast. <gasps> pretty! Pretty, 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 pretty! I've never seen anywhere like this. You see? This is why I've been saying you need to get out of the lab every now and then. Yeah, guys, touch some We're grass. To get inside the bionis. Touch some marsh. We can get to the upper regions from there. Wow. I've never thought about going inside the bionis. The closer we get to the top, the more monster trouble we're gonna run into. The only things I venture this far in are the Nopon merchants and curious types like me. You really know all the fun spots, eh, Dixon? <laughs> you wanna get to the top? Then this is the only way. We'll push Hi, CJ. on. No matter what. That's the spirit, Shulk. Oh god. Oh god, now we're with things that are gonna hurt us for real. Where are you? Too easy. Oh my god, hearing Dunbun say stuff is so weird. I didn't think he was gonna join us. I thought this bitch was gonna fucking die. <laughs> Don't say anything. Hi, CJ! It's so fun! It's so awesome! Look at this! Can they have something like this in Elden Ring? Or any Souls-like game? I feel like when you went downstairs in Elden Ring... That lower part is kind of similar, but... I don't know. It's not like this. Pretty close, though. Like, with the stars in the sky, but they're not... They don't really look like stars, but they're probably something evil or something. I don't know. So pretty. He's lending you a hand. <laughs> <laughs> you did it. The bonfire, true. Elden Ring is missing anime. What's that one anime Souls-like game? I played a little bit of it. It had like insanely like a lot of customization. I Code Vein, yeah, yeah. Do you guys like that game? I didn't get deep into that. Thirty plus hours in the character creation, Jesus. 
It's like... 100% hey, Oh my god. <gasps> no bong! Ah, you enjoyed it? You liked merchants. it? What do you think they're up to? I'm fucking around. They must be here for a reason. Let's go and ask them. Good idea. Gameplay was fantastic. Ooh. What's Juju doing with the group? I guess she's technically here. She's just like not visibly here. Oh my god, it's so pretty! Ah! What the fuck? What the fuck? I would never do anything to hurt you. Ah. So this is a wool rock. Mm. Yeah, level 81, just watching, just chilling. Fucking scary. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna pee. I'm gonna play like... Ah, uh, should we keep playing? I'm already over 30 minutes. I'm a little hungry, so... I'll decide in the bathroom. You're back! I'll take it for the hydration. Fight them, kill them. Okay, good. Move on. Like, there was a. It's cinematic. It's really lovely. Welcome back. Thank you. I like how we didn't necessarily kill him in the beginning, but still had a lot of plot in the middle. And then when you're leaving, then there's the fight, like on the platform that you're supposed to leave on, which is really cool. It gave me like Metroid vibes almost. Like, I only watched my brother play, so I don't remember. I just remember that there was a scene where you're fighting that guy that's in Smash. And you're on like a ship or some shit and you're like flying. <laughs> I don't remember. So 
something like that. Bitrate? My bitrate... Oh, it is going down. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Yeah, Ridley. It's fine now. Oh. Hope it doesn't... It's still pretty fucking low. It dropped by half. My bitrate. A bit over half. Yeah, it was cool. And then after you feed, defeat Zord... And then you see Metal Face and you're like, what the fu... And then he comes with like more dudes that look like Zord and you're like, what the hell? And then there's like this other guy, you don't know him. And then there's like that Riku guy and we're like, oh my god. That was so cool. I just need to like process it. <laughs> it was so awesome. I'm so invested. Yeah, and Shulk's VA was popping off with the screams. <laughs> Fucking Juju. You ever see Satoru Goro? You know can see in daytime, but can't see at nighttime. Trees give off beautiful light. This place is so nice. But I hate compass quad wings. They attack me when I make camp. I wish they'd leave me alone. Can you kill some for me? <laughs> so evil. Okay, they're just gonna give me a bunch of these quests. I'm just gonna take them all. Damn! Alright! Somebody help! Bokoko need help! Ignis took off... Took Bokoko's friend Katya! Uh-oh... <clears throat> oh my god, I keep thinking that... Um... Oh my god, I forgot her name. She's not in our party and I already forgot. Sharla. I keep thinking that Sharla is Dunbin because of his long hair. His long, luscious hair. Not Fiora. Oh, you're done, Subi? Thank you for waiting, young man. You're so polite. Whenever Subi has to eat on the counter because I don't want him to fall, I've made like a blockade. So he can't just fucking fall off. He has to stare at me. <laughs> One little detail. I like how Dumban is a low level now on par with Shulk because he's having to relearn how to fight with his left arm. Yeah, I noticed that. He's level 25 also. Or like, I think. And then, um... Dixon is 27. I thought Dixon would be higher level, but... Oh, he's 27? Oh, Dixon's 30? I thought when we started... They were 25 and 27. Maybe... Maybe I was looking at the wrong thing. Oh my god, we can finally buy shit now! Ooh! Don't we have this? Oh no, we have... Point rifles. <sighs> okay, time to sell shit. <laughs> Did you ever equip Gadol's rifle? Oh, no, because they gave it to us. And then I didn't equip it during the fight. I think they just threw me in there. Unless... 
they gave me the option and I was like, yeah, fuck it, bro. <laughs> Actually, I should probably uh, equip things now and then sell. Okay, let's see. Look at his fit. Let's go. Okay, this is Gattle Trifle. Oh, this one's awesome. Oh my god. Yeah, fuck it up, queen. Oh, an appearance? Oh, shit. Ooh. I haven't changed his in a while. I don't know which one I like more. Sounds cool. Whoa, this one looks sick. Whoa! Okay, never mind. Changes stuff. He actually looks really great with <laughs> with everything. I think everyone's pretty good. I think I'm just gonna start selling stuff. Where are you going? Welcome back. <laughs> So swimsuit done, but I don't want to do it to him. Should I? Oh, I mean... Okay, at any point, if you see me doing something, ah! I didn't know I was gonna do that. The fuck? I'm sure it's fine. Is there no buyback option? There is not? That's kind of fucked up. I didn't check to see if there was a better weapon for him. And I think I just sold it. I did save recently. Fuck it, bro. He's already doing great. Who cares? Fuck it, bro. It's fine. It's fine. Honestly, it's really nice that... <laughs> Pissed 
this. Piston cup? Sell price for this shit. You don't need it anymore, do you? <laughs> no one wanted any of this shit. It's because it's heavy. Something happened. I'm gonna just sell all this other stuff. I'm, like, not too worried if I accidentally... S if I accidentally sell something I'm not supposed to sell, because... If I do, fuck it, bro. We'll eventually get another one. Huh? I think he's just telling me that the ether got given back to me, probably. I'm too scared to hold L. <laughs> Wait. Ah! Jump scare. Woo! Oh my god. If there's no sellback option, then why the fuck do they give me an option to do this? It's so scary. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> I can't. End up with a lot of gear. I'm scared I'm gonna like... <laughs> Fuck it up. Oh, this one's interesting. <sighs> Auto attack max is less, but there's a lot of defense. And I get a slot. Is this worth it? Hmm... Maluigi, what do you guys think? No crit rate. I feel like plus 30 isn't that much better. How many slots does he have right now? Is there a way to check in that menu or do I have to go back out here every time? One. Hi, Salt! Salty? Welcome! Yeah, I'm so excited to play this game. It's so awesome. It's so high. Has more defense, puts it higher for me. Yeah, I was thinking that the fact that there's more defenses in the other categories is pretty awesome. And there's a block rate, too. Okay, let's get it. Um, we're... we're balling, so we don't have to worry. I kind of want it just because it looks really cute on the icon, but I don't know if it's like actually better. But it looks really cute. <laughs> Maybe we'll just get one. The max attack will be higher when you put the strength two gem on a new one. Oh, pug. Oh, this one's good for... Ryan. Yeah, part of me kind of wants to get them just to see what they look like, so we can try them on and then we can look really cute, but other than that... I don't know. I like getting them so we can wear them. <laughs> you show what they currently have? Oh... Cool. 
cool. Thank you. This one's pretty cool. Ow, Sylvie! Some cute sandals. What the fuck? Oh, these are the fucking art books that you guys are talking about. <laughs> Shit, bro. I don't know. I don't want to think that hard. Can you guys just tell me what to buy? <laughs> If I even should, I don't know. I know that we max a couple of them. Yeah, these are Dunban books. If I were to get one, I'll just get one. Okay, let's just do Gale Slash then. Just one. Okay. Oh, okay, so it just shows that I don't have to consume it, it just happens? <laughs> oh goodness, I forgot what I bought. Oh, I bought sandals for... you. Ryan got... a new... this thing. And then strength up to... Uh... Oh yeah, I bought this dumbass thing for someone. I forgot who it was. But... Also, I wanted it for the hat. I don't know what it looks like. That's the thing that I bought? That's so worth it. Cosmetics. Oh. Oh no, it looks lame on him. Why are you smelling yourself, Ryan? Questionable? Jesus Christ, this man. Doesn't suit your vibe at all. What the? Whoa, it shows his scars. It's so cool. <gasps> Wait. Now it fits. Okay, let's see if we have another one. <laughs> he looks so lame. What the fuck? 
I just like that he has a cape. What's this? What the fuck? What in the Evangelion? All right. <gasps> Beach? Oh, come on. Oh, these are gloves. Bro, I don't know. I can't fucking see them. Oh, this is cool. It's the green. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> He's lying. Oh, no. I'm making him look so lame. Oh my god. Why are there little like little nipples sticking out of the, the front? You see that? Those are some erect nipples, my guy. Alright, we're just sticking to the little more. Oh <laughs> hey, we gotta give it to him. We gotta if we he can't look cool all the time okay we we gotta give him some crocs <laughs> okay look how cool he looks <laughs> Oh no, he's so cool! Okay, let me check on Shulk. I haven't touched his stuff in a while. I wanna see what this one looks like on him. <gasps> yes! That's my boy! Oh, I love it. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Put that shit back on. Oh. What are you wearing? I can't tell. The flashing is hurting my eyes. Is it hurting anyone else's eyes? I just wish they didn't... ...do that. <laughs> oh my god, it's so neon! It's like, kinda cool, but... ...definitely doesn't suit the vibe that I'm going for. Yeah, it's like... Cause when you skip like this, it just goes in the model goes in and out. And I don't it hurts my eyes. Let's just do a little little little. Those are some Kingdom Hearts pants if I've ever seen them. See guys, this is why he should just not wear pants. <laughs> okay, they're not that bad. Oh my god. I kind of want to dress them in all Titan wear at one point. Yeah, my eyes are getting tired too. I just wanted to like filter through all my shit before we continue for tomorrow's stream. Just basically have everything ready for them. For then. Yeah, have a good night, Alessa. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you for the raid message as well. That's kind of cool. Okay. <sighs> we look so cool. Now I feel like Ryan's missing out. Get lots of rest. Have a good night. Guys, I forgot what we bought. Oh.
can't get over it. His Crocs. It's so funny. Are these for you? I think these are for you. And these are for you. So you can finally get another slot for something. Jesus Christ, everything's so gray. Looks like that's it. Hello, Chikorita, welcome! Yeah, inventory management, pretty much. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Yep, definitely know what I'm doing. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, checking this. Mm-hmm. Yep. I don't get it. Whatever. Okay. We're dripped up and we look sick as fuck. We got Shulk with the new headgear. Looking snazzy as fuck. Bless you, Shulk. And then we got Ryan in the new uh has a weapon thing, and then we got our boy Dunben with his Crocs. <laughs> it's perfect. We're gonna look great. Ryan's heavy armor skills on one of those other trees. Yeah, on the left one. <sighs> okay. Let's chill now. It's chill time. My brain. Okay. Excuse me, Subi. Good work today, everyone. Good progress. Oh. I enjoyed. I'm glad. It was so hype. It was so cool. Oh, also, also, um... From the throne donation? I forgot who got me the... The scrub daddies. I got them! Thank you! Thank God, now I can scrub with all my heart. Scrub daddies are... The... The superior sponge. Thanks for the stream. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Hope you enjoy watching. It was so awesome. So cool. Yeah, thanks for watching. I'm a little hungers, uh, a, a little, a little headache-ish. So I'm gonna get off right now. But thank you guys so much for hanging out and. Spending time, of course. I hope you enjoyed your time. Um, I'm gonna go look for someone to raid in the meantime, but... Uh... Yeah, Auntie, thanks for watching. I hope you guys had a wonderful uh, time today. Thanks for watching and hanging out with us. If you were... Uh, lurking. Lurkers, we carry you. Thanks for lurking. Thank you for all the new follows today as well. Thank you for the subs, gifts, and resubs. Thank you for the Betty Donos. I appreciate you playing Xenoblade. Been wanting to watch it be played. Oh, Zumaya, thank you. I will feel better soon. I just, I just need some food. How did you know I was gonna read Freed? What the fuck? Yeah. 
Guys, Fred has new emotes and also Fred is four away from getting 1k. Don't you want to be one of those people who said, We were here, Pog you, and be the thousandth follower? Or be there when it happens? Please still be on. So we're gonna go in there right now and we're gonna be like Pog Fraid 1k, right? Because we're gonna get four four follows, okay? That's when it's gonna happen. So thank you guys so much for coming. Make sure to support Fraid. Um mods, thank you for modding today. And especially my three bots. <laughs> we love those. Thank you, Maya, for being such a positive force in this world. I hope that you one day are on the front page of Twitch and can't wait to see your bright, bright future. Nope. <laughs> uh, um, me too. <laughs> Part of me is like, I don't, I kind of don't want to be on the front page of Twitch, you know what I'm saying? Cause I, I feel like if I had the spotlight like that, it wouldn't go in a positive direction. <laughs> But I don't know, you never know. Maybe people be like, oh, cute girl. Uh, I don't know. But that'd be kind of cool, I guess. Thank you for the 100 babies! Thank you, Omni. Very kind of you. Happy mod day. Is today actually the mod day? That's so cute. There's a surprise in Maya Memes channel. Oh boy. <gasps> I got glue trapped! I mean, guys. Yeah! BC! I made it! I, I made it! I'm cool, I'm cool, like a glue trapped. Ha! <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> Fairy in the glue trap vibes. I like how the hat is actually stuck too. Like, that shit would not be on my head anymore. I love that. Realistic. It's almost like you saw that happen, and then you were like, I have to draw it. <laughs> I would never get trapped, guys. I don't get the whole glue trap thing. I don't either, but I think what the origin was is someone on Tumblr, or at least it was a screenshot pretending to look like Tumblr, but it was of Dobby from Harry Potter. Harry Potter. Stuck in a glue trap, and that's all I know. This is so fucking awesome. <laughs> it's so fucking good. <laughs> I just felt like drawing something goofy. It's so goofy. It's so awesome. Thank you. I look sick. Is it on Twitter? If it's not on Twitter. I, I, I'll post it if you don't. I love it. So fucking funny. <laughs> Glad you liked it. Of course. I love it. Thank you. <laughs> All right. I'm hungers. Let's go Ray Fray. Get him to those... Four extra followers. I can post it. Okay, yeah, take your time. Alright, guys, let's go. Alright, we're gonna go raid Fraid. Uh, I'm gonna, let me go grab the raid message real quick. Thank you, Alyssa, for the raid message. Bye, everyone. Thank you for coming. I'll see you I will see you tomorrow at 3 p.m. Wait.
when am I coming on stream? I don't know my own schedule. 12 p.m. everyone. I would never stream on a 3 p.m. on Friday. Uh, 3 p.m. Uh, 12 p.m. tomorrow? <laughs> 12 p.m. tomorrow. <laughs> For more Xenoblade. See you there. And before I don't show up to my own stream. Goodbye, everyone. See you at Freight Stream. Make sure to follow so we reach the 1k freighters. That'd be awesome. Goodbye. Bye, Sherry. Take my Sumiko. Bye, XX. My XX. Also, Kachi. Wait. Bye, Angel. Thank you for your daily watering. Bye, Akai. Bye, Andrew. Bye, Robert. Bye, Omega. Bye, Mongi. Bye, Kyle. Bye, Kuruma. Goodbye, Cyrus. Bye, BC. Bye, Renee. And Raiko and D Hawk and Sensei. And Rekni, goodbye.